predictions? <clears throat> TL dub. Yeah. Three one. Okay. Against the grain. Medias. Oh, yeah? I think TL three one. Ooh, another against the Actually, grain. Uh, I, I think TL three zero. Yeah, I think TL three zero. Anybody who votes EG is just kind of hoping that they can like bet on the underdog and end up looking smart because, you know, it's it's just boring when everyone votes the same thing. But it was actually first big Lee. My hypothesis is that first game will probably be close, but then EG is going to start getting more and more desperate throughout the series and just start clowning hard by the end. Hmm. Either gonna try Tom, to take Rakan. Jinx, Ari, this looks completely standard thus far. Hmm. If you don't want to go Karma, I actually don't know. Tom Kench is Tom Kench is just one of those p picks that he is so strong in lane. He can just completely carry the lane one v two. He's he's stronger than every eighty carry. <laughs> Even against Karma. Yeah, that's why you pick Karma. I just like. I mean, d d is stronger she than stronger than Tom? Tom? Yeah, I think so. I think so. The weird part is how many support bans there are, and now Vulcan's super pinched. They they already banned Nautilus one two three because that's one of Vulcan's favorite picks, and now uh, two more. Oh God, is that really the is that really the move? No, the please. Because it it feels bad either way. Like you could go Zayumi, yeah, but like. Okay. Wow, they're actually going Yumi. Okay. I, I like to say that seems that like EG is going to give him cancer being better. Play a lot. Better. Yeah. How do you even round out this comp? They don't really have any sort of like frontline, very light on CC. Do you need like a fucking Orn? Yeah, maybe like a Scion or an Orn, but. All right. Nar, just, yeah, I don't know about that. Like all. We're just going like all. Free for all, free, just straight free for all. I'm not a big fan of EG's comp. I don't really see how it works together very well. Zero synergy. Just, I, they're, they're I mean, even starting and like finishing fights, like they have really? to just make every fight super like, chaotic, like skirmishes type stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Damn, yeah, dude, TL is like doing, doing their fights. thing of just the most fucking meta golem comp you've ever seen. But. I think their comp has a really, really huge weakness, lacking damage against Yumi. I, I, I don't really like it, actually. I would have much preferred to see them pick a carry top here. Hmm. I, I mean, Interesting. there are two damage sources. It's fucking Ari, which is not the highest damage you can have, and, and Jinx is going to be vulnerable to, to Akali, so... I think there's a big risk a in running damage versus the low, squishy team. The EG has. Yeah, maybe I'm thinking too hard about like the 30 minute mark when Yumi is actually like gonna make any champ feel really tanky. I, I think I think before then they definitely have good damage. You're right. But I think their mid game fights are just so bad. But we'll see. Please. Yeah, there's uh -huh. literally no lockdown. Yeah, yeah. Like he was like depressed after because of, of the like the way that she uh -oh. handled the, their relationship. So she just seems really fucked up all around. Oh my yeah. god. Wait, are they just gonna get zoned? What the fuck is this? He's gonna rock this three oh. melee for sure. Oh. That's oh, actually Hans is a flash. Taking, taking it up the ass. Hans is taking yeah. it up the ass right now. How is Hans a lot of damage. So damage. That was kind of wild. Yumi gap. Yumi. Yeah, Yumi is so strong. Get the fuck I, out of the bush, you stupid that is frog. So, that is so funny. Core went Hail of Blades W level 1 for this play. For this one play. Oh, and I, love I didn't notice it's Hail. So good. It's funny. Like, it's so good because it, it, this lane is so fucking turbo hard. And the fact that he was able to get Flash and Exhaust level 1, it's going to give a dive opportunity. I actually hate Inspired's pathing. Like, where is, where is he going? Why, why is he going topside? Yumi, Yumi lanes always need cover on the fucking on the level inspired. Three. What is yeah, he I thinking? Mean, 
it's yeah, I mean, the, the, it's there's multiple ways though, right? Because from a jungler POV, like if you path to your losing lane, even if you cover the dive, like you can get pushed out of your jungle and shit. Like any fight around the lane is not going to go too well. Uh -huh. uh, and like you also say you're pathing this way and like you have top push, like you have the option to cover with a TP if they do like try to force a dive super hard. So I don't think it's like junglers 100% need to path to this lane. I, think I guess it, be... I guess with the TP angle, I, I didn't think about that at all. But um, oh, level three to level two. This is dive. This is just uh -oh. dive. No flash. He's just dead. Full HP. Any no TP flash. Any TP cleanse. Any TP ears? Oh, it's there not is close. a TP ear. Oh, he got canceled though. Canceled. That's actually no, way better for him. Now. Yeah. Like oh, th th that that idea of like being able to cover it with TP, I think is definitely good um it's weird that they, they it feels like they didn't anticipate this as an option right or like impact could have been in a much better position to actually go for the tp because if he shows up there I, I don't know if they kill him but like they might be able to at least get i some think zombies. him getting canceled is actually way better yeah you think so yeah, it was so yeah the, pl the play was done like the the tp pushed them off it's like it's, it's the same thing as him canceling it from before like he, mm. he he definitely would have canceled it if he could have, but Beep was you saved think, him. I, uh, I'd have to look at it again. Maybe it to me it looked like he could have kept chasing, but Nari all is they, pretty fucking weak. Early. All they would have gotten is um, uh, maybe another flash, because all three Which flashes just, are up. I, I don't think I don't think he would ever want to really commit to that. It's pretty worthless at this stage. One one little flash for your whole fucking lane being cooked. Hmm. Yeah. This oh, gank seems like a waste of time. Maybe not. Yeah. He's dead, actually. Oh. Wait. Yeah, Dixon's dead. Oh my god. Wow, alright. Wow, JoJo's oh. flash there was fucking sick. They oh. actually got that? Oh, wow. That's crazy. I, yeah, I, I was really surprised that JoJo, like, was close enough to the wall to flash over and out of tower range. Because yeah, really, any other nice direction flash. there, and he's just dead. Damn. Does he was, actually have to die there? That was sick. Uh, Jojo predicted his flash with his E. Oh, so that's, that's why, why he, he went. For, this is actually smart. Then I didn't realize he like went around the vision that false sense of security they get. No, this, actually, this was this good. is actually great observing. This is great observing to show yeah. that Inspired took that intentional. Oh, he didn't predict flash. Bjergsen just didn't use it. Yeah, I mean, I don't think Bjergsen played the gank well. I think he was caught really off guard. Yeah. Dude, that charm actually missed. You saw Did that? Inspired not have his W, dude? I feel like from watching closer, closer would have like hit the Q and then W started beating his ass and then followed his flash with the Q. He, he couldn't have that W. War jump to dodge the dodge the. I I know, but like he didn't go instantly. He waited a bit. Wait, Core's pretty chunked. I guess I guess he's not dead. Danny's dead. Oh. Oh. Tom Kench, man, that champ. He's not even close to dead, which is absolutely insane, considering I, th I thought he would just die. Looked like he was much gray health. With he that w. was real. He was real close, but yeah, he got he so much health close. back from something. I don't know what it was. He never pressed his E. I think he just was like one HP, and then he let it all regen back. No, he he did push E. Oh, he did. Yeah. Wow. You can see here. Fuck is this chance so I, OP? I don't, I don't know. It was fucking weird. Maybe he wasn't as low as I thought when he pushed it. Let's see, let's see. You're, you're right, he did push it. He got a summoner yeah, heal. He's There's so no low there, you see that? Yeah, he was, he was. <laughs> but he somehow regens up to like 60. Crazy. Yeah. Summoner heal, for sure. Slightly. I slower. still think there's the whole game they're going to have trouble actually finishing kills. Like, with core there, he can always yeah. wait to like the very last second of gray health and very last second to flash out because there's no threat your your only hard cc is gnar and that's incredibly unreliable i actually think these comps are so trash both comps you said no no sorry these mean like comps without lockdown oh yeah uh -huh. like the type of comp that eg is playing i worded that word oh it's chill brother oh How they play? so they get a splash oh Oh, no, he's don't. gone. He's just dead. Damn. I was thinking if he 
I'm not even if sure he if flashed the Ornall, he probably yeah. would have been fine. But that's not easy when he's that close and you're mega slow as fuck. Yeah, the flash yeah. angle kind of would have sucked. Like, I think he had the flash, like, left in, like, out a bit. Yeah. Instead yeah, of down. So rough. I think it's decently likely he still dies even if he tries flashing that, so he just took the L. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Which is better than flashing and dying. Look at, look at Ari's items. They're just so bad. What would you build? Well, I mean, it's not about what I would build. It's just like, it's just the best build. What they're doing. Oh, shit. The fuck? You're talking was... about the side build? No, Ari. Oh. Wow, TL's just not going to respond to this. They're just like, yeah, this is fine. Oh, hold up. They're setting for a bot dive, though. Look at this. They're canceling Zaya's recall. Holy shit, spectators are leveling up. What the? They are, but... I don't... What the fuck? Did Inspire just leave the game? H how I did they just lose that Herald and Wave? No, I, I don't away. think stop. I don't. I don't think they can stop Whippo. No, he was like, he's he's not. He wasn't diveable then. Maybe with Megan now he is though. What's he building right here? He's buying some shit. Oh, still got. Oh, I mean, he's fine. even if you can't fully kill him, like you should at least be there for the crashes, Lee. I don't know. That seems very and weird 17. to leave like that. Wow. It's got some pretty nice wave glue. I don't know if they can actually do anything to him. Clears the I wave. I think you can chunk the fuck out of him. And then get on the next wave. Yeah. I was going to say, they use Herald top and they lost more plates on... The enemy team got more plates bought. So you already... You know something went super fucked up. You're supposed to get first turret with Heralds. And they, they ended up getting like... I think like... Maybe three plates top, but bottom loss. Wait, is Whippo not inting? Hold up. Oh, he has heal. Wow. Fucking he healed summoner out of that heal, w. dude. Uh oh. Do you think Impact knows Santorin's here? Maybe. He might have spotted. Oh, him. Han Sama, they don't know Jinx is here. Uh, they actually do. There's a ward. No, they have no idea. Oh. Oh, I like this. This is a sick play. Yeah, yeah. This is the overstay and just fucking. This is the tempo in. trap. It is. Holy shit, five head. That's honestly just a. Do they check it though? It seems like. They just walked away. Jinx. Oh, oh. Hansama has oh. some idea this could happen. Maybe. Hans is actually usually pretty aware, and I think on a Dude, team as, still in as experienced as TL, oh wow, he's actually, oh, what oh the fuck? Did you see God. Inspired's You? It's Wait like he sec. lagged. Ah. <laughs> well, well, that's not closer. Huh. He like, Wait, flashed his flash was so troll, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah, he flashed W, but didn't actually even get behind him. I don't think that's how you play that situation. No, sir. That is not. Unlucky. Man, EG is so desperate here for no real reason with that camp. I thought it was fine to look for for like the first 10 seconds and then you just give it up. But they stayed for so long and made yeah. it actually terrible for them. Closer was in my chat. Ask him what he thought about the Lee Sin combo. He typed like a, you know, like like, like ASDF whatever. It's a whole bunch of nonsense. Hmm. Freaking out. Freaking out. Centaurin would rather use ult there than flash out or have TK eat him. But God, Jojo's in, Jojo's just like getting free farm turret and he's pressing with TP. He's so happy. All his team needs to do is buy time here. I actually don't like what Tails doing. Tails really low HP. Two of them are pretty chunked. And I think Jojo has not the best TP options actually, but yeah. Yeah, it seems a little weird to commit so heavily to just this dragon. Considering it's not like, you know, 
Yeah, that's on a game changing dragon, and, and, and look what's happening to your top lane. Like, you lost three waves and a turret already. Now you have to go up, and then JoJo's gonna have a timing to go mid, or he's gonna have a timing to go bot and take bot tier one. Or to take the rocks. Uh oh, or die. Take oh. your Kruggers. Oh. That escape by JoJo was insane. Whoa. But Inspired Spin's farming pretty well. His farm is good. Somehow he ended up having a really good, uh, good early game. He ended up getting first. He ended up getting Herald, Drag, and not falling behind in farm. So maybe his least in mechanics need work, but his game sense seems to be on point. But he's so young. Oh no, impact. Is Inspired young? Yeah, he's super young. He's like 20 or well, something. Oh. Whoa. Where's that ult going? Baron check? I can Baron, yeah. Yeah. I mean, that's good to recognize. That's a threat when you go for this kind of play. Although, EG's Baron damage is super fucking terrible. Like, I don't actually think you could even do Baron with that comp. I think you would die. I I'm just trying to put myself in EG's shoes. And I don't even know what the fuck I would be looking for at this point in time. Like, if you're Lee Sin, wh where do you even want to spend your time? Like, what can you do other than just clear your camps? Mm. I think the window is kind of passed for making great plays. It's kind of just going to be dragon fights. Yeah, yeah but like, how, how do you get control? A colleague uh... pushes. Yeah, I mean, I don't know if it's necessarily about control. Like, I think Hill's going to have the control, and you're going to have to walk in on it. And oh. you're not just going to insta-lose the game doing that? I mean, it's uh, going to be with, rough. I think with, I, I think with Zaya Yumi, you, you, you're pretty good at ARAM. Honestly, their ARAM comp is better than TL's. They have a lot more healing. giving up Dragon. They're not even going for that. Yeah, yeah I mean, they do have a healing and poke. I think what the? you're... What the fuck, Jojo? This is so troll that you would even like... Does he kill Whippo here? Up? What the oh. fuck is going on? Uh, he, he had some weird vision. Yeah. I, I think he thought he was dead, but from oh. RPOV... Nice. From RPOV, he was actually fine. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Like, he, he... He overestimated how fast the enemy team could be there to punish him. And, and and in instead of just walking away there with like R2 flash he he just, just Yeah, I, I think he's easily step. out for sure. I think yeah that's probably a much harder read to make in game. Like he they actually have zero vision around there. Yep. Yeah, that's true, that's true. Definitely one of the risks of playing with Yumi is that you just have awful vision control for the most part. Cause you know, if you're unless your jungler wants to sack all of his farm to just be the fucking second part of your support character. You know, you just have no one actually like go around warding. Yeah. Right, to your point about the like the only other play that they can do is like dragon, like walking on a vision. It's not actually that dangerous. It's just Ari. Like if they can find a blue orb on Ari, then they can't really get picked. Like the rest of their pick sucks balls. Yeah, but I just I don't mean even just coming down to like how do you get into the river without oh. just like getting Fucked or like take a good fight. Shit's dead. Oh. Now what? This is a mm. pretty good. Tail's gonna get for wiped. Tail's gonna get wiped. Tail's gonna get wiped. Judge is dead. Or do they? What? Oh my what? god. If, if EG could fight, what? that would have been the fight. But their comp just sucks. Fucking balls. Hot Summer just <laughs> walked into fucking 50 feathers, man. It yeah, was, he, he, was he had to. That's. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, yo, how the fuck did did that fight not go better for... I, I thought, based on how it started, EG would have such a good time. They had... Positionally, they had a really yeah. good fight, but... Yeah. Th they literally have the shittiest team fighting comp. Like, I, I don't see how they win. Did... Well, well, I'm, I'm trying to... I'm trying to think about this. Like, Lee Sin hits the Q. I don't know what he can really do there. Maybe he takes it and kick someone's ass, but I'm not really sure who that would be. Kali kind of died too quick. She fucking went in and it was just one HP. 
Oh, wait, I'm trolling. That was mini. I don't know why he th I thought he was a fucking big boy. I'm gonna watch Akali again. Fine, so how, how does Hans live here? That's what I want to know. Because Jojo ults the wrong person. He ults Bjergsen. Ooh, Inspired has a pretty bad ult. He ults Tom. I, yeah. I guess he he and wanted to get the angle to like knock Tom into Jinx. Holy shit, those feathers. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Hans just like walked into that shit. But I think that maybe EG would have had to slow play a little bit more. Like I think they jumped the gun because their comp like... If they're gonna win fights, I feel like they have to kind of like kite them around. Like they, I guess they have pretty decent kiting with Zaya and like Lee Sen. Really, the main problem is Jojo died, right? I, I think yeah. I think if Jojo if Jojo's able to get like another rotation off of like Q Auto R two, he probably mm -hmm. kills Hans there, probably. And if Jinx is dead, maybe they can win the rest of the fight. But he got charmed pretty quickly and he just got blown up by like non-targeted abilities I, I think he got blown up by like charm req and then maybe i don't even know oh there's a whole bunch of other abilities that could hit him in his shroud and uh yeah that is uh that is a fucking blower i was almost gonna say that there's like hope for eg since it's cloud soul and if i if i'm like playing the scaling comp which I know that's up for subject, like subjective debate. Like, you know, is the Yumi, just because they have Yumi, are they scaling? But like, maybe their best chance when they're losing is just to pray for like a flip fight late game with Yumi. Ooh. This guy doesn't take damage. This guy doesn't take damage. Hmm. Oh my god, inspired! Uh... Oh my god, inspired! He's actually just trolling. You're a bot. <laughs> Like, I, I'm sorry. Like, he's. he's I don't a think great Lee Sin's this guy's best chance. He's champ. a bot on Lee Sin. It's crazy. Oh. It's really unfortunate for him that he had to play right after closer. I know. We got we got oh. spoiled by closer. Oh, that was a grief. Oh my god. Yeah. How do you finish anyone? Well, can't. You Literally know. can't. He tried he tried to flash over the RA charm, but it, he did it too fast. So he just ended up flashing straight into it. I think he was actually looking for a decent play of like reaction, flash over the charm, and finish the kill, but Jesus Christ. Yeah. I think I think Zai is definitely on a, a level of her own in terms of just like how self-sufficient she is. With Jinx, like you need the Tom Kench. With Zai, you can play any fucking direction you want. You can play hard engaged. You can also play like a kite back poke comp because she can poke. Problem this game though is just like you said, their comp doesn't make any sense. And I think everyone's playing like shit. Like this comp is... I, I don't know any better way to describe it. It's a solo queue comp. Like, if, if you play better than them, you might win. And and the, the fact that, like, the problem that's happening is, like, their Lee Sin's hands are broken, and Akali got charmed two fights in a row, and there's only been two fights the whole game. They gave Akali, like, turbo free farm in side lane, and got her ahead, she got first blood, and, like, yeah, I think JoJo's a really good player, but, like, with the amount of resources he got this game, free farming top, getting an early kill, he didn't really do anything. He just got caught in side lane, killed himself. One walked to the next fight, got charmed, died. Next fight, got charmed, died. It's not it's not easy to solo carry games with Akali, obviously, but um, I expected him to play a little better. Yeah. I think unless TL does something demonic, he really doesn't have options this game. Because even if he does get on one of their carries, who like you know Jinx traps cuck Akali super hard. Ari Charm cucks are super hard, and then you've got a Tom Kench, if you do somehow get in. On top of the fact that his team has no real other threats, it's like... Yeah. I, I don't even think it's possible unless TL fucks this. Like, I'm just imagine yourself in Han Sama's position right now. Like, are you really ever scared of Akali? Well, I think their best bet was at that Baron fight where... Yeah, some Akali crazy flank. Angle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The, the flank angle is like... That's, that's when Jinx is super in trouble, because... TK is not going to be able to save you, even though you get, like, three seconds of, like, fucking... Oh, oh Inspire, oh. steal it! Oh. oh. Wait, Inspire just goes in? Dude, Inspire does actually... Oh, wait, is, is he, what? like, is he awake right now? Is he... Are we on planet Earth together? Or, or is he on, like, fucking... Is he on shrooms? Like, what's happening? FF, please. Just FF? Oh, and it's gone. Get out of this game. Uh, the game... Was was 
not win like that winnable. Okay, there's like four, they're four K ahead. Tails, Tails like four K ahead, but like what the fuck was that? I don't know. That was fucking weird. Okay, maybe I'm trying to maybe give him some credit here. Maybe he thought he could like go in and press stopwatch, and like he's like too slow, so he ended up getting like chain CC before he could press it. I don't know. Oh. Yeah, they didn't accomplish anything this game. Okay. Damn, dude. And looks fucking bored. Yeah. He's like, really? Why did I even have to show up today? Put fucking Greg back in. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, true. Oh, I, I keep forgetting. Danny plays with his shoes off. So after every game, you're just going <laughs> to see him put his shoes back on. Who's who's the other player that did that at LCS? There's another one, like way back Maple in the day. Maple Street. Really? Maple Street? Yeah, he was the first one that like that had a big thing about it. Yeah. Jesus. He was like trying to celebrate a win and he's like fucking putting his shoes on and like just doing it really awkwardly. <laughs> it's kind of <laughs> hilarious. Uh, I'll be right back. My food's funny. here. Yeah. There's a lot of hard champions, but it's funny because like back in the day. Um... Or like Zach. I feel like anyone who can play Zach just has a huge dick. Oh. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Huge slimy green cock. Sorry, what were you saying? Did you say Zach's huge slimy green cock? What? No. What? How guys, showed you guys that one picture. I never even thought about. I never even thought about that he might have one. Hold up, I got you. No. Are you gonna give Here, him the picture? Not, not safe for work. Don't, don't look at this on stream. The Medios GW3 pick. How do you remember? Wait, it's, your, do you... it's your fucking emote for the no. graves. The graves no. face. Yeah, no. GW3 MA. What is this? It's your what? Name. Ah, what the fuck? <laughs> Don't look at it on stream. Don't what? look at it on stream. <laughs> Not safe for life. Have saved? What do you have? I don't have it saved. It. I just memorized it. What? <laughs> oh my god. Because it's funny. <laughs> What the fuck? Well, you know, just that... scrolling around the I internet thought, and you guys, find things. If I show this on stream, I'm actually going to get permabanned off Twitch. There's no doubt in my mind. This shit is so vile. What is... Yo. No. Just one art. of my fucking... One of my favorite bits... Because this, this picture's been around forever. I think I first found it in like 2015. <sighs> but I was like streaming the League client and I made it my desktop background where like the client's just covering like the all the middle of it. So you... <laughs> you couldn't see anything bad, but like you could definitely know what the picture was. <laughs> that shit was so Perfect. funny. Oh Yo, that's my lit. God. Oh my god, no, dude. Hey, wait, you're actually stupid. But what if your lead client wouldn't load? So yeah, I I had your to like go into a fucking something. paint and like actually oh, censor I see, it I see. <laughs> and then put the lead client there because yeah, I I, wonder, I worried the same thing. I'm like, fuck, I don't want to get random banned. <laughs> <laughs> this Christ. It's such a funny picture. I looked at it for literally one second. I don't even know who those other characters are. Was it There's like a insane? lot of debate about who's in the middle. Graves, <laughs> Darius, <laughs> Zach. <laughs> who's the last one? I don't know. I want to look at it again. <laughs> it's Graves, Darius, Zach, and Alistar. Oh, Alistar, yeah. <laughs> 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 no, God. It's pretty I good. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm not looking at it. I'm gonna get in trouble. <laughs> You'll never find Shit. it, Chad. Misfortune. You'll never find it. It's in the depths of the internet. Uh, you asking about the draft going on? <clears throat> Where is mm. the graves? Or Darius, Zach, and Alistar. They're unpicked yes. right now. Why is no one Six. playing pool party graves here? <laughs> They're pretty OP. Somebody actually took like hours probably to draw that. And I got to say, if that's like a commission, that shit would cost a lot. I mm. heard that drawing like not safe for work. Um, like, oh man, I don't know if we should be talking about this. Wait, dude, have, basically have if you draw, If you draw furry porn, you can make a lot of money because there's, only, there's like such a small market for it, I guess. Or like, what am I saying? There's like a big market for it, but there's like not many artists that are willing to do it. So the artists for that get like a shit ton of money. They say not all heroes wear capes. <laughs> yes.
Oh. Wait, what were you guys talking about? Sorry, I had to, uh, I had to smite some users. What happened? There was some linkers in the chat. No. Oh. Some dirty yeah, little linkers. Not... Yeah, we, we don't, we don't promote that here. Of course not. We don't, we don't promote it. Oh my oh, god, shit. Alistar. TL playing Alistar. Alistar! Zach, Zach, Zach! <laughs> Come on, Zach top. <laughs> Dude, I feel like TL just makes sure they have one late game carry. Like, if you don't have Jinx, then you have Victor, and then you just play whatever with it. Mm. Yo, Silas. I think TL always just seems to have a better, Tom. a better read on draft than than most teams. Like they they have oh, Graves. Okay. Oh, oh my God! They oh, actually have so many. Cool of them. party Graves. Let's go. Damn. I think Diego would be in there if he's wearing a very like deep v-neck yeah he's a sexy man with a nice chest oh, <clears throat> oh what was i saying though uh, tl's read on draft is really good i i remember talking to yankos and I, I thought what he, he said was really interesting about draft he's like saying like draft is draft is like 70 percent of the game like draft is so important so he like he loves talking about draft with his team like all the time and he thinks, like, one thing that he really values is, like, players who are good enough at League, just, like, skill-wise, to play any draft. Like, to play the right champ for the right situation. And, yeah, I feel like that might be, like, pretty undervalued for pro players. Is like, how... And, and it's hard for the audience to know, too. It's, like, how hard are you really limiting your teammates because you just, like, won't... You just can't play oh, certain yeah. things. Yeah. And that feels so huge. bad. And it feels really good when you when you play with a guy who's like, like Whippa, right? He he plays Orn and Jace, or sorry, he plays Graves and Jace and Trinomir, but he also plays Orn when the situation is good for it. And like, I don't know. Part of it is like ego, like the fact that he doesn't need to be the carry every game, and part of it is also just like he's a good player, so he can he can help his team draft well. Yep, mm -hmm. definitely. Mm hmm. Oh, he's going pool party graves, dude. He's actually pool party graves. <laughs> that is the best skin. That's so good. For unknown reasons. We do have Lethality MF. Oh my god, he's using the new skin. I don't even know if it's good. <clears throat> MF is actually considered an answer into Zaya. And when I played Jamin's with Core, he told me to try it. And I don't really see it, actually. I think... MF has so many problems. I'd say the biggest problem is just that so much of her damage is in her ulti. If you if you don't get a good ulti, it's such a it's such a feast or famine situation. What the oh, fuck was that oh, damage, oh, bro? Oh. What's happening? Who wins? Who wins? What the oh! fuck? <laughs> How is Bippo so good at knowing his damage? Did he? Yeah, he, like, man. He, he really played that one well. Wait, no, like <laughs> mind I, controlled I would impact. Not, I would not expect Gragas to win all in versus graves level two well he, he like, canceled graves e with his e yeah mm. that's pretty cursed yeah. for impact oh oh, Jojo oh my god get it good reaction by Burek. he's still fast on the flash enough till w doesn't go off he knows he knows yeah i guess it, longsword versus deep light actually did make a difference that 80 hp would have changed the all in no joke so let's see, let's see here. Bwipo, he hits level two on this melee minion coming up right here. One more minion for him. Oh. Oh, that damage oh. was so crazy, man. Like 250 damage all came out at once. Yeah. And he gets a grass proc and it just barely Bonk. puts him in damage range for the bomb. <laughs> I think he did the auto cancel like on Bwipo was just like, all right. I guess <laughs> that's the only way to react to that, but yeah, okay. yeah on Gragas, you, you can like E right as he starts his auto animation, like auto cancel to do that burst that he did. I actually don't see a lot of people do it, but it is pretty like unexpected when you get hit with it. I feel like when you're jungling, you just like do it automatically without even thinking. Yeah, like it's just it's just like inherently like you know that your W is just like eight kills. It can overlap with your E. Oh, oh inspired, inspired again, oh, doing the two points jump. in E. Uh oh, yeah. this... I think they smell it. 
Oh wow, Vulcan didn't what want to commit. The but does it kill? I don't think so. Yeah, I was, I was thinking even about close. that. You gotta try on the cannon. So, so what I would say here is that TL, because of that earlier play, now they what? He again? He didn't commit the flash. All Hello. This is dirty. Vulcan. It's so fucking is your, obvious. They is, know. Is his brain on? What the fuck is that? Wait, he's fucking kill. griefing. It doesn't kill on the second time though, because Core's stacked, so he can just headbutt him away. Yeah, Do you but like, think his ease at all? Why is he even pushing the button? He's literally not close. I what don't. The Do you fuck? think he's trying to mind game? Like, do you think he's trying to be like, you know, he'll just, because you know, you yeah, guys talk about how yes. E flash is so so fast on Leona, it's hard to react, react to. to. Yeah. You think he's trying to like expect Hans to just react to the E alone with his flash? I yeah. Don't think so. It, it looks so fucking noob. Literally a year away. Yeah, I'm. I don't know. Hard. It's it's hard to it's hard to imagine. Yeah, like I I I see what you're saying because like if that is the case, it, it would totally make sense what he's doing. But <laughs> it's like no a, he's mind gaming happening. nobody. He's mind gaming himself. That's what I see yeah. it as. <laughs> yeah. yeah, and also also the way that I would see it as is after he makes that first like E. Now Hans and Kor know that they're getting ganked. Yeah, exactly. You, you would never ever in a million years press E there unless your jungle is there. So so in that case, the second time around, you just fucking send it or you don't go at all. That's what I think. Yeah. Yeah. Vibe check for, for EG right now. Are they in shambles? Oh. Gragas? Look, guys. What is that mana? I feel like Three? Impact just wins this. Or oh. does he? Oh. Oh. <laughs> no shot. No Wait, shot. He oh almost my god. There. Holy shit. Holy moly. Is that even. Wow. Did Where Whipple was he trying to cancel flash? his auto or did Impact flash it? it like, he flashed it. He flashed it. Yeah. That was so fucking close, man. Oh. Oh, wow. That, that W was sick. Oh. Jojo does no flash, not no have flash. flash still. I feel oh, like Santorin. No. Yeah, I they mean. I don't know. It, it, he could have probably killed him there, but you can't do that without knowing where Lee is, or you might just hint it. Well, that's one of those didn't things. Did see him like... top recently? I don't know. Maybe I, you can't yeah, go for I that. I, I don't he... think it's horrible to back off there. It, like it, it would have been. I don't think it would have been as clean if he did kill him. Mm -hmm. Oh, Whippo dead again here, but almost better for him <laughs> to just kill the wave. <laughs> Back to the tower, bitch. Ooh. Yeah. Wait, what? What just happened? The fuck? That looked weird. Oh. Pop died and then bot died. Oh. Winging back and forth. Big whip. Yeah, yeah it, actually, though. She, she can be M good for sure. MF doesn't usually push in Zaya, which is why I'm so confused about why she's considered an answer. I think. I actually think this comet build is also a bit of a trap. And when I, when I played against Hans one time, he was doing the crit build. And I think even in this game, you know, having Gale Force seems pretty good, pretty damn good. Um, the 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 comet build just feels like you're you're gonna get like your one big ulti off per fight and like maybe some damage, but it's really unsafe for you to auto because you don't have Gale, and also your autos are super fucking slow and don't do much damage. Yeah, I think it's hand. it's definitely like more of a supportive build. I don't think yeah. you do this build to be the carry. It reminds me of Varus-ish. I guess you don't really have the crazy poke he does, but Aaron Ash type champ. What is Jojo doing? It feels like they know they're here. Hmm. Oh, they, I guess they they know Perfect. he can bait, but they don't have any damage now. Let's Big see. Realm War comes in. Oh, graves the Graves in. Realm War. Oh. What the fuck? Hold up, oh. this is actually going well for EG. That yeah, was, that's good for EG. That was a pretty oh. crazy rise all, uh-oh. Oh, oh. Right, you said. flashes in? Whippo has E flash R. No angle. That was really good. They, so EG postured top, they cut off Whippo from the play. So Perfect. at that point, it's like EG's all four in, in river and TL's split up and they can just commit to one side with rise ult and just have a numbers advantage, so. That was actually a really good good way of using Rise. They have him wedged between two lanes, ready to go to either. Um, I was like, 
I'm like not that sad about the rice pick this time because the lanes do seem pretty spicy on both sides. Ghost Man, he's rice. He's um 4k gold. Oh! Oh! Hex flash combo. But Nothing, wait. Though. Did he just suicide? Good. Is he even yeah, dead? Yeah, looks like, looks like bad fight for them. Oh, oh, bouncy, bouncy. That's just no damage. Yep. I think mm. it's because Rise scales exponentially off CDR, right? He's one of those champs that like is like Ezreal in that sense, where the more CDR you have, the more reset you get on your existing cooldown. So... Oh shit, hold that thought. Core is dead, unless somebody can save. What <laughs> the fuck? Core is really making Alistair look good. <laughs> I think Alistair is a solid champion. Oh. For He's running dead. it down. He was Wait, a pretty I, solid I, champion in the picture. What's I saw. your guys' game time at? I think I unsynced. So, oh, eight. Eight. Nine. Oh, I'm at like 15. Uh, we can speed up, yeah. Right, I'll just this. try to. Hold on, I'm watching Impact. Reaction's uh, like five seconds late. Impact? Oh, almost predicted the flash. Still dead, maybe? Shut yeah. down, still dead, still dead. Wait, Vulcan, he has Ignite. Kill, maybe, nope. A little too risky. Yeah, uh, too risky. Try to speed up and then I'll pause Okay, count Wait. your time. Oh shit, hold on. Hansama is taking it. Nah, he's fine. I'm at 41, two, wow. three, four. Oh. Okay. Immortals is How is not C9 in playoff, fighting TL? Like... <laughs> yeah, Immortals not in playoffs. C9 fishy. fighting TL. I did see CLG in one of those matchups. <laughs> oh, I mean, I got you guys. <laughs> you got us. Get on hard. I'll have to question every bit of information from now on. Oh, what the? F I guess he's <laughs> dead. Yeah. Oh, okay. he's gone. Hmm. Oh, and Vulcan's dead. Oh, Ooh, wow, wow, that's, that's so flash crispy. Sig with it. So crispy. Oh, shit. Oh, double kill, oh! double kill. Oh, there's the feathers. He didn't have, he didn't have it. <laughs> Inspirers is beating the fuck out of the turret. He's like, kill <laughs> yeah. the shit. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm telling you guys, if Faker's a 9.5, then Centaur's a 9. Oh, in in, yeah, in hotness. Nine inches? I think so. Are we sure 9.5 is high enough for Faker? You mean... I'm thinking he's more like 12. Oh, oh. shit. What if so there was actually big. a correlation? It's like the fucking like League of Legends gene is somehow mm -hmm. attached to that one, too. <laughs> well, well, nobody's disproven it so far. What are you trying to say? Inspired I'm just trying walks to stay up, up, Wait, beats Inspired the fuck out of the just turret. rolled up and started... <laughs> <laughs> it was no minions, he's just door. like, fucking kill this shit. <laughs> yeah, I'm just, it's just wishful thinking, guys. That's all wishful I'm thinking? I think you mean, Bubble has a massive, uh, brain. Biggest brain. Oh, oh. Satorn, please. Oh, Damn. he got his ass kicked. I know that feeling, Inspired buddy. Inspired doing things on Lee Sin? What is these this? Red buffs. Yeah, these red buffs are, are real tricky. You guys are hating on Inspired. Vulcan uh -huh. with another 200 I'd like brain to lag E. Oh. What the fuck is even going on this game? I I didn't even realize, looking at the score, that EG is, is so ahead. It, it was close, and then I... I feel like Core just ran it down a few times in a row, yeah. and yeah, now dude. EG's pulling ahead. Yep. I don't blame Core as much as I blame his champion. I think he troll picked. Huh. I wouldn't think Alistar is that bad this game. Really? Isn't he pretty I mean, he's, garbage? He's just kind of trash in general. He's not. He's definitely not a good champ, but. Um, if there was a game to pick Ali, I think it might be this one. It's like good versus Lee Sin. The enemy team is playing like three low range carries, so it's easy for him to combo. It's like it's hard for Alistair to do much when he has to like 
flash or flank just to get in combo range, but in this game, you can just kind of, like, walk okay, up to people. Tell me this isn't the That's highest three. value Braum game you've ever fucking seen. Graves, Rise, MF, all completely cucked yeah, by Braum. But, like, True. Zaya Braum? Maybe it's actually fine now that the Zaya build is totally different than what it used to be. And it's Fuck like a lane. Different. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, are you winning your lane with Alistair? This chance sucks dick. <laughs> I mean, TL does have pretty good scaling, but I mean, if, if EG gets way too ahead, then it doesn't matter. Yeah, the the scaling component is honestly, it's the second fucking Cloud Soul as well of the series. One in five, it's a one in 25 chance of this happening, by the way. Um, two Cloud Souls in a row, but I would be, I would actually be decently comfortable this game with just scaling. Say one I know in that's insanely 25? boring, but like, yeah, because it's one in five. Oh, one in five. Ooh, what a combo! And that MF alt though. Oh, holy shit! Whippo, holy you shit! Cannot just do that to people holy on Gragas. Oh my man. god! Uh, uh, Core and Whippo are fucking just. That dude, was such just... a nasty engage. Uh, get out! Get out! Get out! It's it's Jesus. good enough. Jesus, you you don't see Gragas just kill whole teams like that. No, you don't. That was fucking juicy. Holy fuck. Like, the back and forth there was so crazy. Because when Core first went in, it wasn't that good, actually. It was, it was, it was like, it looked good, but he was going to die for free. And because he was going to die for free, EG just thought it was, like, their turn to turn the fight around. So they, like, started all, they started, like, running forward, thinking, like, oh, this guy fucking, he, like, he trolled. He flashed in when he shouldn't have went in, and then... They didn't. They didn't have a ward over the wall, so then Whippo just fucking comes from fog. That was. Let's see it. I was distracted. Let's see this banger. By. They your, don't have vision in. Your pit. math was confusing me. Oh. Right here. Oh. oh. And then. And then the same angle happens again after. Boom. Oh. Same flash. That was four people hit by the fucking R. That's a nut. Yeah. Wait, Bobo didn't even insane. explode his Q. He could have done even more. God, it, it's almost a shame that TL didn't get more off that play. Like, they, they should have gotten a lot, but they ended up okay. only trading one for two. Did oh. anybody notice how Impact fucking pushed in bottom and then TP'd top and pushed in top? Oh. <laughs> Wait, what? Like, after the fight. The fuck? Wait, Centaurin's just oh, fucking dead. Weepo's dead. Yeah, they're lose, 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 I don't losing. know. They can't they chase anymore. Pipe, no? Ooh. Uh, <laughs> and they Baron? They have Rise. Dude, Rise ult's just so terrifying. People just drop it, and you're like, oh, I don't want that fucking shit. Do you like try and sprint out of it? It's I don't, it's I don't actually, know if EG it's really can hard do this. to do Baron this looks against. Looks pretty sus. Oh, yeah, yeah. They're and really hard. They're doing a lot of damage, but I think Impact needs to be in the pit helping Lee tank it. That's oh hard. god, oh it's, it's awkward. Oh it's yeah. awkward. Ah oh, no! It, wait, Inspire just uses W. Oh, I think EG is not playing this well at all. They're holding it. They're holding it. Oh god. Wait, wait, it's Inspired is tanky. committing to this fucking Baron. Oh, Yo, help him! Oh, help he has him no Baron. Dude, he has no smite. Oh, he, he wants no to smite, smite earlier to heal. Smite, he used smite to heal. Holy shit, Matt. I actually wow. think Impact kind of trolled this. I like, don't like how Impact was positioned. I think he should be in the pit with Lee, just in melee range, tanking the Baron. First of all, the fucking yeah. stack is passive. Like, he can full stack his passive, and they take zero damage tanking it. And so yeah. then the the Victor Zaya pokes way less threatening. Yeah, but impact is just kind of. I think them in the pit would make here. way more sense. Like most of them, besides one. Yeah, Cause, cause I, they can't I think all impact poke. really messed up here. I feel like Rai should be in the pit too. Like he's fucking worthless doing the like run around in the left bullshit. Yeah. But but like guys, when you're in that situation, it's really tense, and people are making like so many calls, and I don't nah. I don't blame. It's tense, but like, this is just how you play Baron. I mean, some people literally just don't know. Like, I, I think me and Meteos talked about it a while ago, where like, playing in the pit on Baron is such an underrated and underused tactic. Yeah, like, uh, so almost every that carry I, I played with is fucking terrified of the Baron pit. Like, they do not ever want to enter the pit. I they think they'll that. just die. But I like, agree, yeah. mo most of the time it's fine. Like, even if they kill you, they'll probably lose the fight. It's so much better for a lot of situations. I think that yeah. is one of them. Because you're actually safe as fuck in the very back. Like, they can't just run past Baron to get to you. 
it, it's a trust exercise. You don't want to be in the pit if you don't if you don't feel confident that the people outside the pit are going to have your back. But like, if you commit to the guys in the pit, the guys who are outside are going to kill them. That's like that's like kind of the logic, right? But if yeah. everyone's outside the pit, then they yeah. don't, they don't ever have to commit anything. Yeah, and like, I mean, so see, the person the who's left. tanking Baron in that case also gets super fucked over because they're just yeah getting railed by they're Baron and you can't really fight. Yeah. That's funny. I, I do I do agree with you guys, but I think in the moment all three of them pussying out at the same time is like not uncommon. I do think it's oh, uh, like you're definitely right. Definitely not uncommon, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you're definitely right. That was better. Oh shit, they don't know he X flashed over. Oh the smoke? Oh this flank. Zonius. That is a nasty flank. You're just gonna fuck them. Bjergsen actually saves Whippo is oh. Whippo is making a lot of time. This realm warp does uh -oh. nothing. He's out, he's out. Oh, he has flash. Wow. The fact Damn, this he... is so okay. EG should just start it, man. They, they need to take advantage of the fact that they do it really fast and they don't take damage if Graves and Lee Sin are on it together. I don't this is literally the fast. best way to start a fight is Graves. Dude, they they don't see Lee Sin. I wonder if Teal knows this. It's about the information you don't have. If you don't see Lee Sin, he's probably flanking. Or he's just getting your gromp for free. <laughs> what the fuck is going on? They Do they... Teal doesn't know. They're, oh. they're going to get... Dude, they just... Oh, they they just let his friend get Gronk. Oh, oh no, he missed the Q. He actually doesn't need to do much here. Yeah, it's, he a, it's a fat cleanup. Oh! <gasps> okay, he does nothing. Nah. <laughs> we should get Baron here. And now it's now it's Baron for them, yeah. I think Teal should be okay with just farming now. This is the worst shit. How did Santorin die? I actually wanna I didn't take a peek at, at his death. I think EG just killed him. Oh, okay. <laughs> Unironically, he just died. <laughs> they just went for the fight. Oh, Teal does get dragon though. <laughs> this this that... game is going late. There's it's going fucking... late. Both teams are at two dragons at 28 minutes. Yeah, and the soul doesn't matter. So it's not even going to be the, the... If there was a soul win condition, it won't even be that. It would be the elder that that changes yeah, anything games like this are always fucking weird because it's like wait what now Mo most games you can just keep playing for dragon on repeat and win yeah but there's a lot of time you got to fill before that in this one sneaky you were trying to do the math there's five dragons and each soul has an equal chance of happening so it's 20 percent, 20 percent. you said 25 <laughs> it's i said one in 25. did you say one in 25 Okay, you said one yeah. team, sure. I, I heard 25, and I'm like, what? 125% oh, chance? That's more than 100. 125% chance of two clouds. I literally heard 25. Yeah, math is and I'm awful. Like, hmm. My bad, my bad. I, I, maybe I should have said 4%. But it's, well, yeah, it's I, I just 25 games. I missed the one in. Yeah. I don't, I I don't see how... I don't see how EG. Ooh, by the way, is EG gonna... is really gonna group into the side lane. I don't like that. Oh no no, Whip was dead. Yeah, oh I just don't still like it. I'm done counting. And they don't and have a mid wave to fall back to. Just... They're they're actually just full committing to this. I guess they have Rise top. You, That's at this than point, TL here. should pick one side that they're willing to give, and it's definitely bot here. Like yeah. giving bot. And 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 the way that you would make the Baron low value for the enemy team is just. Yeah, dogpiling probably topside right now. Oh, or maybe not. Not the grumpy. Dominoes. There's oh, TP Jojo is getting baited. You really think Hans is just walking up by himself, or he's tooling them? Or he Jojo knows. doesn't give a fuck. He's showing some skin. He says, you want me, boys? <laughs> Oh yeah, yeah. He he. Q checked the bush. He's lifting up his skirt. Why oh. he gotta have a skirt? <clears throat> show the skin. I was gonna show the skin. Good. Oh my god. I'm done counting. Skirt, skirt. Core JJ. It's oh my god. Core is such a god to survive there. How does he do it? So good. Definitely didn't throw this whole game and become worthless. <clears throat> Oh, he picked Alistair, dude. You can't hold that against him. Everyone's worth the I don't chance. know. He had some troll engages with Alistair, though, didn't he? Yeah, but I'm, I mean, that's yeah, just it what, was, it's, it's forced. It's when you're on that champion, you have to. Do you don't think it's the I same think. as, like, El Leona going in at a troll time? Yeah. Or Nautilus? Yeah. I think They're, it's like, the same. equally dead, right? 
I do think though. Yeah, but like Leona's way tank here. Unless Alistair yeah, has R. No ult. If Alistair has no R, yeah, he's just the fucking most worthless piece of shit. Oh, nice. Oh. That was uh, that was really good. And that's actually one thing that, that Zayas do really well. You auto through the wave, right? And the Cyrilda's passive slows them for a second to guarantee that you hit the next... Uh, the QE afterwards. Is it proc off autos? Yeah. Yeah. Cyrilda's counts Zaya's like feather autos as uh as an ability uh uh-oh oh wow teal's actually getting kited around yo jojo oh, got jojo. the tenacity potion you see this oh, oh. santorin looks pretty boned here oh wow oh, is this oh. to live it's over Hans Bad is dead. Drinker. yeah did so you gg damn eg and fighting just back. like that came by them the three O predictions are dead. We have ourselves a series. I mean, now the question is, is EG oh. just going to three O? Jesus, how did Impact flash that shit? Ooh. Is EG going to three O? Says Medios. Yeah. We'll have to put that one into the question mark book. What the fuck? Wait, all why the did... minions just emoted. Yeah, I you saw, saw that. that. What was that? It was it. It was a Bud Light emote. No. Did Did you see the I'm April Fools' at... leak head? Uh uh, it it was kind of insane. It like you got turned into like a random fucking like minion or like jungle monster. Like you, you could literally be a super minion or a red buff. I think it was only supposed to happen in base though, or something. Wait, it was I funny totally as fuck looking. Again, what is you, it? You, like it turns your character into like a minion or a super minion or like a red buff. So, what like, does? April Fools like oh I think that's like the April the good April Fool shit where like you actually do something funny yeah yeah that instead of like good. just trolling with some like lying shit it's like Definitely Easter agree with the alley being a huge problem TL's comp is pretty normal in fact like Zaya Victor is probably one of the strongest backlines that you can have since you have like a really self-sufficient long range AD carry and like the harder DPS from Victor. So really like building the comp around that backline, I think Viego and Gragas are pretty normal. Those champs are just totally normal. I mean, they, I think TL just gets outplayed. Wouldn't say that draft was an issue for either team. Uh huh. I mean, the alley, alley is probably the one thing I would switch out, but. Damn, Whippo had a very easy early kill and then he just, he kind of griefed it away. Actually, wait, did, on this engage right here, TL trolled that, right? Like, both of them going in at the same time? They didn't chain? Yeah. Let me, let me see. I'll pull back. Yeah, they did troll the fuck out of it. Because they actually easily could have killed Rice if they chained it and locked him into the, the uh, Victor W. Yeah. Huh. I think it's also that Victor is just so bad early game. He does no damage for real. Well, I mean, Ryze is just, just terrible, right? And like, Ari. No I think they're all pretty uh, they... equivalent. Like, Victor being highest damage there. Out of, the, out of those three. Victor, Ryze, Ari. Dude, you know, I think Ari Victor kills there. I think Ari charms. Well, that's the and charm then, And then gap, finishes though. with ult. Yeah, but that's because of charm. That's what I was saying. Yeah. Like, the, the chain CC being fucked there actually mattered. Yeah, that's true. Because they could actually Giga Chain. Like, they start with Santorin W on Viego, into Alley Combo, into Victor W, into Alistair yeah. E. Like, he's yeah, just, that could have been big. He's just fucking dead before the Alistair even goes off. That's something that's hard to, like, honestly very hard to recognize in a game, because you're, you're more, way more focused on, like, actually getting the catch and, like, starting the fight. So then both your engagers go at the same time on the same person. And Alistair's CC being so short. Like, that, that is an Alistair gap, too. Yeah, just like that, every other that little downtime. A, a really, it, it, it would be so much easier with, like, fucking Rel or Nautilus there. Yeah. Or Braum. Just kidding, not Braum. Yep, yeah, Braum. Maybe. With Alistair's that, that weird downtime where, like, you combo, and then you have to wait for your E to charge up, and then you can actually stun. Yeah. 
Do you guys know about Dota? Like Dota has an easy mode. Um, like the the normal mode is called all pick, AP, and then like if they you still have that want to play 2? more casual, huh? Do they still have that in Dota Two? Uh, yeah, they do. I well, back in, like the Warcraft Three days. Back in the day, I I only played easy mode on like the Warcraft Same. Two one. I played it. I played all random easy mode because I didn't know what any of the heroes or items did. Oh yeah. my I just god, sent it's, it. It's called Turbo. It's called Turbo now, not easy it's mode. Turbo but in Dota Two. Okay. The game is just accelerated by two times like you get way more experience you get way more gold um yeah i i think those casual modes and stuff in league definitely lend itself to it because for me i don't know if i would have gotten into league if there wasn't like normals i played like a shit ton of normal games just for fun yeah and just like accidentally learned how to play the game i wasn't really coming in with the intent of trying to be like a pro player true but uh, yeah, obviously in fighting games, that those modes are a lot harder to make. Where it's straight up for fun. Back in the day for League, it was called Dominion and Twisted Tree Line, right? And and those modes were so unpopular compared to Summoner's Rift that they just decided it's not even worth our fucking development time to to keep updating it. We're just gonna discontinue it. I oh, think it was also no, because line. bots were going crazy in those modes. Yeah. I think that was actually a pretty big uh -oh. factor in getting rid of them. Right, they're actually spotted here. What are they gonna do? Perfect. Are they I think self TL might just get jungle? blasted here. There's only three, yeah. I mean, they're for sure dead if they're caught. Yeah, they're... Is there any way they live? I, I don't know if they live is they go down. They go down to bot lane. I don't think yeah. they'll die. I think Bjergsen's gonna have a hell of a time mid. Oh, wait, unless oh. they walk into him? Wait, you're hey, spoiling game it, time? bro. What the fuck? I'm at 25. Oh, yeah, no. Oh, my God. <laughs> Bjergsen, it's a horror movie, it's a horror movie! Bye-bye. Oh. Oh. I hate to see it. Wait, what time are you guys at? I'm at 140. I'll, I'll go up to you. Can you keep counting? Speeding up. 42, 3. Be good. Damn, dude, that was so unlucky for Bjerg. Well, somebody in chat says, why would you walk that way? He literally has no idea that they're there and is walking to his own lane. Yeah, but dude, even me, a silver player, can see the whole team's in the bush. Why would he walk in? I'm pretty sure dude, he's trading. Why the fuck did Bjergsen not just pull up my co-stream, dude? Doesn't he know that I'm online every si playoffs? Dude. Is he Isn't he noob? paid to play this game and he doesn't even know they're in there? Like, that's, that's pretty noob. Did they just oh, miss XP on that? XP, yeah. Is the matchup that bad? No, they just completely misplayed. It's not that bad. What did they do like, wrong? Like, how do you avoid you this happening? Just, you can just hold your own bush, and I think when 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 you let Nautilus walk in there and you're out of the bush, then it's totally fucked, right? Then he, then his like range of of fighting you is just so huge. But if you if if like Danny and Vulcan wanted to just literally just sit in that bush, and if the enemy team wards just insta kill the ward, then they can stay in XP range and they can kind uh -huh. of jiggle out of the bush a bunch of times just to get random minions when they can, and then obviously back off on the second wave and. Uh, yeah, be okay with it. It looks like they're looking for die. This is gonna I mean nothing though. You can't die. This, this is crazy counter jungle from Santorin. It really is. I don't and think Inspire he... knows this is happening. Wow, this no, is he's actually a, he's brutal. about to know. He's about to know when when he does walks this way. They should ping. Yes, they did. They pinged exactly where he was. Dude, but this, Santorin this is... has EQ. Yeah, he's oh. completely fine. Oh my God, Vulcan Ooh, just twenty six. Twenty six, dude. dude this he's is rich. This is actually going to be so rough for Inspired because, like, he just cleared his topside camps before this as well. So he's going to have nothing to do for a while. And Santorin can just full clear his jungle now as well. My question is how did Santorin do Wraith's Red, Raptor's Red, and cross mid into the enemy jungle without being spotted? Did, did, did Bjergsen just have the push on Rise even though. Even though he got killed level one? That makes no sense, right? I don't that, know. How, how is it. How did that path end up happening? I'm not sure. I like that we have Whippo pass here and checks the Krugs, knowing that's like really the only place Inspired can go. Yeah. And again, this is what makes champs like Nocturne and any champion that doesn't have mobility is so much harder to play oh. than someone who has it. Oh, he's going to get Second, the Raptors. Raptors for Inspired. He has this is really big for no six. smite. Yeah. That's absolutely yeah. huge. Oh. oh. Yeah, that's really good for him. That's insane. And a Krabby Patty. Yeah, like in hindsight, if Santorin knew the timing on all this stuff a little bit better, he could have skipped one of his bombside camps. Like his. No, but 
Gromper Wolves and then been here on this time. This is a dive. This is a mid dive, but Bjergsen has flesh. Does it work? How could I it work? Let's see. I don't know about this one. Dead. Oh! Cross kill. Yeah, great kill. Still uh, so good for good JoJo. Good for EG. JoJo kind of trolled that, didn't he? Like, you saw early he started that dive. Like, Nocturne yeah. wasn't even close. Yeah, that was a little weird. JoJo's kind of... JoJo's kind of fucking Bjergsen in, in lane. Like, he's playing better early game. Yeah, that he's already solo killed him one. twice. Dude, that was crazy. No, no, like, I mean... Look at that dude. light on Bjergsen, holy shit. He's so I know, bright. he's angelic. <laughs> Can you get Perks's hat, please? Holy fuck. <laughs> Think of the info play here. That ward shows that Centauran is nowhere near to cover. And even though Inspired has the option of doing top crab, they have a big wave coming in mid. It's it's so easy for yeah, EG to make this, this decision. Yeah. Oh my god, he just tanks. Per oh my god, he almost died there. That was like so yeah. incredibly close to dying. It's, although I do think the play is good for EG. There was like a pretty big opportunity cost for Nocturne going for that, like instead of farming his camps. So I don't think it was... Super insane for EG. It's still pretty good. Dude, Whoa! What is Hans doing? Wait, Hans? What? What the fuck? I was unlucky. Why did he walk back up? He just didn't think that that Vulcan would uh would walk up on him, I guess, and challenge it. Oh! Would use his hands. Oh, and here we go. Does he get is six on this? Six Does he get oh. six? Oh! But it doesn't matter. He was, Danny would just only have Wait, a flash. Wait, click on Jarvan. Let me see his XP. Yeah, I do want to see How it close too. do you think he is? But I think Ash is just not a very good champ, so Jinx is pretty happy to be 10 CS down in lane. He's a supportive champ, so this kind of goes against what I, it looked like TL was doing in the first two games, where they have like, you know, one super scaling champ, and then you can play supportive stuff elsewhere. In this, they kind of have like Ari and Ash, who in my mind are kind of, you know, supportive yeah. type champs. Like they enable other carries more than carry the game themselves. So, I think this kind of comp, TL can run into some problems later in the game. With oh, definitely. Killing people. Definitely. The, the, the thing that I, I think like might be their saving Graves is Nautilus Graves is, are two of the hardest champs for Jinx to play against. Just because when Graves, literally Graves W is like a hard CC for Jinx. <laughs> I, I, I think like it's like a fucking, it's like a ranged spammable like two second stun. Because you're not auto attacking Spamable. anyone. I mean, it's it's not sustainable, but it's it's always up. So if they if they play if they play it well, I think like Graves can stop Jinx from doing a lot of her bullshitting in fights, just hitting people for free, and then I think mm. they have some hope. I do I I believe in EG's comp so much more though. Whoa. I think TL got outdrafted here pretty hard. Oh, oh my God! He's God. dead. Oh, what a fucking play by that! So one. overextended. What was Han Sama thinking, being behind his tower like that? And this is so bad for him. <laughs> Wait. No commitment from EG. I think, I think that could have been more for them, but they decided not mm. to go for it. Garvin was there, and they were really low. I, I don't know. It's a two before, and I guess they don't know where Bjergsen is. So mm -hmm. even with a two number advantage, they feel like it's sketchy, and maybe Ari will come and clean them up if they go for it. Yeah, it was plays scary. like that that force eighty carries to be humble. Oh, that yeah. kind of shit. You're just walking back to lane and you get fucked and you're like, ah, that's just how it goes sometimes. <laughs> oh, dude. AD 100%. carry and top laners are the roles that I have like the most sympathy for when it comes to just getting fucked, like completely outside your control. Just yeah, bang, yeah, bang. yeah, for sure. Mid laners don't really have that. I mean, that, that just feels absolutely horrible. Fucking Hans is supposed this is supposed to be a pretty winning matchup for him. And at the end of lane phase, he's behind. His turret is minus one plate. Oh, dude, Leona is just not balanced, bros. Just not balanced. Not oh. balanced. What's happening? Oh. The arrow's coming. Big the arrow's all. coming. Can they take out Nocturne? Oh, they do. Do they have this enough damage left for JoJo? Yep. Wait, Danny's trolling. Why is Danny playing like this? He's so deep. Oh! He has to. Oh. Why is Danny oh, playing like this? Got so lucky. Huh. No crit, would, BG. He, uh, honestly, honestly, Danny, Danny got, got robbed. Yeah, Dan, he got Danny robbed of a montage. Dan, Danny would have reset, but he would have died anyways. But that just seemed 
so fucking greedy. It looks Walk a little desperate. Not even, I don't even know. Like, he, optimistic is what I would say. That shit is. I mean, that not that the desperate or the definition of desperation is like you go for something you yeah. can't go for just yeah because you're, you're like, I fucking need this shit, bro. Like you only tunnel <laughs> on the potential upside more than like thinking about what's actually going to happen. <laughs> yeah, it was so close, though. I mean, dude, if he if he finishes that kill, it's like I'm pretty sure Hans lived with five HP. Uh, I, I don't know what would happen if he got the reset. He might have just he might just kill Hans and get out. See this again. God, Leona is so fucking tanky. It's disgusting. Ari's also not a lot of damage. That makes Ari, sense. She Ari lived so long. A, Ari did like a thousand plus damage. Which was a bit surprising. And after this reset, it's just... Okay, so now I'm watching Hans and Danny here. Danny feels like this is a montage play. Hiya! Oh, charmed and stunned. Feels bad, man. Ari with the resets. I wonder if... I wonder what Vulcan was calming during this time, because his ult was up in like three seconds. You saw he threw it there right at the end. I wonder if he was like giving his team confidence, be like, yo, my ult's almost up. Go, go, go. I got it all. Then he's like, yeah, fuck it. <laughs> I don't know, but after playing with Vulcan a good amount, he, he's definitely not the hypey. He's like the very calm and collected player. Giga Chad player. He's just like, he'll just say stuff like, I'm looking to go here. You know, really. Mm. He 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 he's not like the who he was. Firm. Like, I'm looking. I'm looking. I'm looking. Oh. And spamming the the target call. What is Cor Wait. how does Core do it? Uh, he's pretty hypey actually. Core is pretty hypey. He got insta canceled on this realm warp. Jesus. That was such was a slow death. A fucking yeah. slow burn. It really was. I wonder. Uh, this is probably just. Showing like how fucking little I know about Rise, but I, I I don't really understand why Spellbook Resolve Secondary is 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 now like the go-to over Phase Rush. Yeah, I, I don't know. I like Phase Rush as well. I mean, what are they taking Resolve? Is it just like late game tanking this stuff, like bone conditioning overgrowth or what? Plating. I think it's bone plating. Bone plating, else. really? Yeah. It's triple cloud. Is this now? It's a one in one hundred twenty-five chance, and I'm kind of. I'm kind of worried that the TR might be bugged. Uh oh. The fuck is happening? If it happens again, I'm gonna be worried that the TR is actually rigged. Wait, if what happens? Rickson, Rickson's alive. How lucky is he, by the way? Impact. Not gonna go for the Q snipe. Oh. I'm a little bit like. I'm so I'm so confused about how EG started this game off in such a good spot and then through a series of just like unforced errors ended up two drags and two and a half K gold down. So many unforced errors. Yeah, they and just they just got outplayed in fights. Bryce has gotten picked a lot. Jojo's like really good for the first ten minutes because he's always seeing angles to fuck over mid. I mean, if anything, JoJo and Inspired have been playing better mid jungle for the first 10 minutes than TL, but like afterwards, they're just so off sync. JoJo's constantly dying in side laner or getting dove. And it feels like whatever he gets advantage early game, it just gets equalized by 20 minutes. Seven. Like he was really ahead, and now he it looks like he's worthless. He's a level down and like 20 CS behind. And now he's just playing ARAM, ARAM Rise. How could this ever work? Uh, through mid, okay. Yeah, I don't, I don't know about this one. I, I think here, if you're EG, sure you can flip this fight if there's nothing better to do. But I think Impact moved a bit too early. The timing's not going to sync it's, up. I, I think that if TL contests this, this will be good for EG. I think TL should probably not contest it if EG is going to invest so much into the setup. But look how early Impact moved. If he goes top here, he's not going to be there for the setup. So right now, if I'm going to see, does he beeline? Well, he'll yeah, he'll so have TP wards at least. That's true. Think about what but, I would do if I was TL yeah, here. Yeah, dude. If if TL just goes down mid, I kind of, I would like them sending someone top and then just pushing mid and then walking top with the wave, even if they get the dragon. Yeah. I, oh. I agree. Santorin's taking Santorin's some spells. Taking he's not going to die. Ooh. Oh wow. Oh. 
Oh! Wait, that's what? Oh! Santorin's alive? Are you are you kidding me? He lives? They all they, live. They oh should just, my god. I mean, god. I think TL fucking. I think TL kind of got lucky getting out of that without anyone dying. Yes, they did. Yeah. I would have much rather TL just sent Ari top and then just push the wave and like push mid and then rotate it up because EG's not really good at walking into them. That was a fucking heist that TL didn't all die. You're right. Like that 600 gold shutdown. That 600 plus a 150 assist. So that's a 750 gold kill that just got kind of cheated out of them. The guy fucking lived with one HP. I'm actually so surprised that Nocturne didn't kill. It, it felt like he either didn't press red smite. I, I could be wrong. He either didn't press red smite or he like missed some damage. I don't... Yeah, I mean, it didn't look like he tried too hard to do damage. It, I think he he definitely stride breakered maybe a Q while he's flying, but then he flashed out, which oh. is probably the play when you're against that comp. It's quite oh, a bit of CC. Let's, let, let's see what this kill on Blippo ends up giving EG. They're going to they're gonna have they position. they kill him. Oh, yeah. Oh, go. wow, you're right. They killed him. Whoa. That's 1v5. Actually, so EG has Baron. position on Baron. Now they're going to force Bjergsen's TP. And Impact is Impact's doing a pretty a pretty good play is... here. He's basing so that he can have a good TP angle when they're pulling them in. So, so yeah, like, waiting for a home guard. Waiting for a cannon TP. He's like, give me a ward, bitch. Give me a ward. Yeah, give me a ward. Oh, I think it, they should just finish it with Tannin TP. This, this ward right here on red. Oh, this ward's literally shit. dead. Why is that? Why do you go to such a bad ward? Oh, oh my god. He had to smite for HP. Oh. Oh. Wait, oh, what the fuck? This isn't even that good. Wait, no, what Danny just happened? Man, impact. What was that TP? That had to be a misclick. That what had to the... be a misclick. What the fuck? There's no fucking way you TP there on purpose. What the fuck? Holy shit. Oh, that was, that was such was a so throw. Laggy. That was actually a free Baron. Huh. Just do, just finish the Baron. If they come in, like, finish the Baron, ask Ken and TP's in, so they... If they want to flip the Baron, they're all going to die, or they have to back out and you get Baron. That was such a troll TP by Impact. I, I just want to see it again, honestly. I I am also confused. I think a huge part of why the Baron was so hard is inspired is fucking 1 HP off Baron. Yeah, I mean, he shouldn't be solo tanking it. Like, he has no armor at all. That's why... I don't oh. think he can do the Baron. That's my opinion. I think they definitely can. I think Leona should be helping tank. Oh, oh god. Whippo's just inting side lane. It's huh. disturbing to watch. Wait, he got solo kill to a cannon without ult? How the fuck does that happen? I don't know. I didn't see that it was a solo kill, but... Yeah, it was no assist. Perfect. Interesting. The f they didn't need to show that. That something fucked up must have happened. Dude, that was such a weird situation, that Baron. Like, how do they not get cleaned? We're, yeah, by Jinx, right? Rising Jinx, like, not That's what I hitting? imagine, too. No, yeah. it, it, it was... They actually just played it so bad. I think... I don't know oh, how Vulcan plus? ended up where he was when he was. Oh, wait, he has was... a flash. A flash? Is it kill? I guess oh, not. Oh, this peel, man! This oh, peel! Oh, my God. Oh, Jinx there's the Jarvan 1v9ing. Holy! Oh my God! Oh it's wow! It's all ogre. Oh wow! That was oh. like. That's kind of like. Both, both teams are just standing there waiting for the enemy team to overstep, and like, EG took the bait. You know, they saw Hans. I, I, I don't even think it was that crazy that they went in, but they just barely didn't kill him. And all of TL is just waiting there. That's actually the power of just sitting in fog. Something that... Let me see this. I think this is something that like a lot of people don't truly understand. How strong is it for you to just be waiting outside of the enemy team's vision? Here, they see three, and they don't know that Ari is like, right there. And they... Oh my god, he's just so close to dying, but doesn't die. And now Ari's here. Huh. Jesus Christ, man. The that cleanup. was just... So fucked. Like, I think Leona missed everything on Ash. Like, he queued Nautilus, 
then Ash Gale Force and Vulcan's E didn't hit. Yeah. And then I don't know if he had R. I, like, I, I think he had it and he threw it. I just didn't see where it landed. I am absolutely baffled. Maybe at no one how... can see where it landed. Maybe it just went to another planet. Maybe. <laughs> Did it just yeah. full whiff? Because, uh, like, These Ash are... actually got touched by nothing. Yeah. It's, it felt like no damage. Ichi's having a lot of trouble converting their advantage into winning fights. I think Ari's a little bit stronger than Tank Rise at this point. <laughs> Ari is actually so broken. I thought she was totally useless, but it was just because I was playing with people who weren't like great at Ari. The champ seems. Her crazy. resets are so nasty. Oh, shit. Yeah. Wait, I, I've just ulti my mind. Oh, oh my. You got countered by Zonia's. That's. What's going on not here? A good time. Wait, Ash? Uh, they're going. Ash, Ash might e. die. Dead. Ash might die. Dead. EG is getting oh, in there. Uh oh. Jarvan. Jarvan's too powerful. On Danny and, and beats Jarvan Ash. is just. Jarvan's a carry. I told you. <laughs> I told yeah. you. Yeah, but actually, too powerful. Unironically, just kills Jinx. I mean, I've gotten solo killed by Jungle Jarvan's with Red Smite. Like, fuck it. He's like, I mean, he's he's pretty fat. He's pretty bad. He's pretty bad. But. Yeah. Fucking hate my life. Yeah, that. The score and like the way this game ended doesn't show how close this game actually was. I think EG was really insanely close. EG to had a lot of opportunities where I feel like they could have won the game, but they kind of threw it. Man, that Baron was actually just one of the most dirty things I've ever seen. I, I need to go back and look at that. I I can't really see how Volk controlled it the way he did. Which one? Like, which one? The one where Cannon TP'd into red buff. Oh. Yeah, let me see. You said Volk controlled it? Yeah. Let me pull it up. Like, they're doing Baron. I think Vulcan should just be tanking oh, it. Oh, yeah. And then they should get Baron low, just throw a ward in their face, and just have Kennen TP to that. And then you either get an insane fight where they're all stacked on a Kennen ult, or you get Baron and they back off. That was pretty fucking chaw. <laughs> what the fuck is yeah, this? Yeah, he's engaged? going for a fucking flank on Leona. Yeah. Like, help, help your jungler with zero armor tank the fucking Baron. Yeah. Yeah, and then, like his engage, and then he just flashes over the he's wall. Not, he's not even able to minigun. He flashes in. Impact's TP ward is so far, and he also goes to the even farther ward instead of the pink. Like this should have been completely fucked for TL. They. It wasn't a real situation for them to even contest. I think they only did it because they they had the pink that saw Vulcan go for the flank. Yeah, they griefed the. F fuck out of this with that exact positioning you said danny's just like on the side of the pit for no reason and then vulcan is like like they're they're playing for the fight turn here but just look at fucking nocturne <laughs> he just died yeah, dude he's <laughs> he's not a champ that actually can he doesn't even have tabbies like he's just getting murdered by baron he just pushes r and it's like well that's my use and he goes in he and had to fucking smite turbo just feeds. to not die to baron and then instant and then dies on ult again yeah. EG seems to EG seems to like when they start Baron, they, they they already have it in their mind that they're gonna turn, but but they're not playing for the chance that the enemy team plays too slow. Like that's that's the option that's not getting covered because they're not committing to killing Baron. Like the you, the only the only time the enemy team is actually pressured to walk up and stop you from doing Baron is when it's about to die. So you need to get to that point first. I think that's what they are not playing great around. It's like they think the enemy team is gonna just walk into Cannon's TP and all die, but Baron's at sixty percent health. Like they're not pressured. So, maybe they just got to stop starting Baron the way that they are, or they just have to play it better. I think the start was pretty desperate in the first place. Starting Baron? Yeah, like, they killed Graves. It's 22 minutes. I don't think yeah. their team is necessarily, like, a Baron killer. Like like you were saying with Nocturne. No. I mean, like, Rise you, you Jinx, can't... that's pretty fucking good at killing Baron. But I just tank. It's too early in the game. It's too early in the game. I the one like you need a champ that can tank Baron without taking a lot of damage, and like they don't have one. So every second that they're on Baron, it's like equalizing the I, fact I, that it's. I a think if four. you're okay with, like the the risk of this is is what right like that they just hard engage on you while you're in the pit, right? Like that's the worst thing that can happen if you just are four man on Baron. 
with Leona helping tank, right? I, uh, I think yeah. that's still totally fine because you'll just drop a word in their face that Ken's going to TP to. So they either, if they walk forward into the pit to fight you and try to steal, Kennen's going to absolutely clean up everyone. Or if they back up, like maybe at best they like charm Kennen on his TP and one shot him or something, but you get Baron. I feel like if you play this scenario out like uh, 50 times in a row, I feel like Teal, Teal wins. Com comes out on top most times here. What I think ba the risk really is, is. TL can just stand there and wait for Baron to be low enough. And by the time it is low enough, somebody on EG is... They've taken so much damage that it's not even a 5v4. It's like a 4v4 with like one person at 1 HP. Yeah, so. I, I, I do think they're just getting too chunk. But I, I, I agree, Medias. I think they should not have Vulcan fucking doing this garbage. Yeah, <laughs> I, mean, um, I think it just dies, dude. If Jinx is minigunning it, if Vulcan's actually tanking it so Nocturne's stealing damage... Yeah, I don't think it's just it's that hard to kill with these champs. No, I I, definitely I, good Baron killers. I think they can kill it. I just think the other angle too is that Bipo is gonna come up and he might be able yeah. to clean up. Yeah, this is why you just start it. They got time. Yeah, it, it might be the best option, honestly. I, I but, don't know. I, but I'm looking at Baron at five k HP, and if that damage isn't on Inspired, who's ten percent, then it's gonna be on Vulcan. He'll be ten percent. So yeah, but I mean, they they, they can split can they tank do... it between Inspired Vulcan. Also, it'll die much faster because Inspired doesn't have the damage reduction on them. Yeah. Yeah, it's just. Can, a, can I guess also, the question like... is, can they do five thousand more damage to the Baron before TL just kind of like walks up and takes the four v five? And I think I think taking I think so. that four v five could be. I don't know. I don't really know who would win that. But I don't know the the way I I, the, the way that they played it was definitely bad. I think Kennen wins it. What do you guys think Kennen should have TP to? The way, oh, the way well, mid. In, the in this exact situation, definitely the pink word. Like or, or mid -wave. Near, near Vulcan. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, I think mid wave is better. And then angle, like Vulcan but, needs to walk yeah. up as soon as Kennen starts TPing. Uh-huh. Cause like TL's comp doesn't have that much damage. If they Full on engage on Vulcan. They're gonna have to use a lot to kill him, and then they're definitely all gonna die. I think. I think Kenan would want to take a different angle than Vulcan, since they would both get kited from the same direction. If if like Vulcan's but, coming. Yeah, from yeah. The top. But the thing is, if you're kiting out that way, you're not going getting to Baron. Oh so it's yeah. Fine. yeah. Like that. That's the reason. That's the threat that makes Teal have to walk up. Is they have to stop Baron. I also think Danny trolled the end of this. You, you guys see Danny? Yeah, I, chasing Danny it like seemed to troll a lot of this game. It, it's like the someone's like calling kill Santorin, and four. but Danny should for sure target core. But and he's like stacked with Rise, so they both get Nautilus ulted, even though it should have only yeah. hit Rise. Yeah, he and could have he, potentially cleaned up. Yeah, he can't even kill Nautilus, and if he kills Nautilus, he can kill Ash. Oh yeah, then he gets Ash. Yeah, yeah. he has both sums. Yeah. It's fucking uh, weird. Kind of late troll XD. Looks free as fuck. A little bit, a little bit. EG loving this Rise. They really think Rise is just the best. Wait, why did Danny play pick Ezreal this game? I'm just confused. I don't know. I didn't I didn't know that Danny even played Ezreal. It There's a lot of AD carry bans. It feels Dang like he, he, he picked it and then they banned 80 carries. They banned 80 carries that T Hans just loves playing Ash. Why would you why would you ban these two 80 carries and this not Ash? Oh my god. This is a fucking totally uh, You need Braum. Braum actually makes this comp work. He just drafts fucking turbo sus. I just I, I I like the rise top. That's a pretty cool flex. Um, and I I've seen Impact play a shit ton of rise. He sometimes fills mid as well and just plays rise. I don't know how this top matchup goes. I imagine they flexed it because rise shits all over, uh, GP. Or wait, here's actually what what could be happening is JoJo could be playing Lucian top and it could be a lane swap and not a not a champion swap. Oh, maybe Impact will just go mid this game. Yeah, that's possible. I feel like EG Cause, cause got is a, a little lost in the sauce on this draft. 
Yeah, they're they're getting really next level. I I I don't hate it if JoJo's gonna go top with Lucian and they're trying to throw a curveball at TL. I think what what really fucking sucks is if I'm on EG, I'm just thinking there's almost no way we're gonna win playing standard. TL's just better than you at it. You my have to do something ears. to play to your team's strengths. Yeah, my ears got fucking pounded. Really? Mine wasn't that loud. Probably had it too low though. So, I mean, assuming that you don't win against TL playing the same style that they do, because you're just going to be a watered-down version of them, maybe their their angle now is to do some crazy shit, like do hard counterpick top, send JoJo there. He's a good laner. Maybe they can snowball off yeah, his yeah, side. Yeah, it, it, it definitely is. JoJo has armor in. They showed it. Nice. That's good. And they're cheesing good. the you, top lane. You, you literally push. can't lane Lucian into Victor. Uh -oh. uh -oh. That matchup's unplayable. Where's Rice going? Oh. Oh, 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 wait, wait. Did they abuse the vision? Oh, God. Where's one it's HP? Oh, of course, dead. Wait, oh, EG's winning. EG's winning. Holy shit. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> oh, my God. Well, wow, they actually got oh, fucked. Holy fucking shit. Dude, EG blew no flashes. What the yeah, fuck? I am confused. Zero to four flashes. Yeah. Holy shit. That's oh fucking my crazy. God. TL, TL's champs just are so shit level one. Like they they, they just they can only kill one person and they get terrible. Kited. Yeah, it's just the 80 carries. Yeah, it's just the triple 80 carries after this kill. It's like, whoa, we're winning boys. And then all of a sudden, no, you're not winning anymore. Dude, this is actually a fucking TFT comp where you just have one. <laughs> yeah. yeah. The just walks up. Insta killed. Wow. God, that's hilarious. That's a banger. I'm a. I'm kind of not a huge. Like, I, I just. I'm so curious to watch, to watch Danny play. Oh. Uh, to play Ezreal. What do you guys think about the Treasure Hunter rune? Have Wait, you played he... with it yet? Oh. Is it out? I have not. I have not played with yeah, it yet. Yeah, it is out, out. But it's it's it fucking horrible. weird, dude. It doesn't it? It's like 550 gold if you just kill everyone once. Reboots is 400 gold guaranteed, and you don't have conditional gold coming in from like a 400. In my in my eyes, domination 400. is now shit. Yeah, because you get 300 gold free boots and 10 MS. 10 MS is worth 100 gold. <clears throat> Okay, let's just let's just ignore the 10 MS. You get 300 gold guaranteed. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> or, or you can have 550 gold conditional if you kill everyone on the enemy team once. In a game where you kill everyone on the enemy team once, are, does that gold not just straight up not even matter anymore? Oh, Jesus holy Christ, shit. that was a sick dive. Sick Damn, dive, sick bro. Dive. And Fired is like, fuck this, dude. I'm not farming this game. Yeah. I don't give a fuck. Well, it... The the gold thing, the only real thing I think to think about is the fact that, like, if you're already going domination, like electrocute or something, then it's just you you know you replace the life steal with just bonus gold, potentially. Yeah, that's true. If you're already going compare, domination, yeah, like, it's but, hard to straight compare it to the boots. For but that domination reason. already felt like shit. There's almost no champs that go electrocute. Um, Predator is actually pretty good, but. Then you would want to go in It's like Halo Hunters. Blades a lot of times, I guess. Yeah. It's the common one. Could do Halo Blades, definitely. I think Dark Harvest and Halo Blades are pretty niche. They're only played on like a one or like a couple champions. Fucking Draven, Kaisa of Halo Blades. Can't even think of anyone else. My my read on Domination now is now that Ravenous Hunter is gone, the, the the tree is just kinda shit. Like it's so rare mm. to be it see it being good. In fact, wait, there's actually not a single domination user in this entire game, not even secondary. <laughs> like, it, it, True, it, it went from god tier to just total ass because it was carried by like one rune. Taste of Blood yeah, Ravenous Hunter combo. I don't, I, I was playing with it a little bit. I, don't, I didn't think it felt bad. It's like a lot of fucking gold. It's, I don't think it's bad in a vacuum. More that, of course, dead. No flash. Dude, okay. Dead. They say Perfect. everyone on EG had Treasure Hunter this game. Oh. They would have got like fucking so much gold from that level one. They legit would have got like a thousand gold from level one. 
That's true. That's true. Two kills multiplied by um, 70 plus 9. So it's it's actually 160 gold times 5. So they got 800 extra gold from those two kills. Yeah, basically 1,000. If not more. Oh, God. More than 1,000. Wait, what's smite happening? It. Oh, smite. shit. Give smite. He doesn't. Yes. Oh, shit. Must Jesus. be behind. He's getting just saw ass. smite. Wait, uh, pretty sure too early. Dead. Hook soon, hook soon. Oh, no, never mind. Oh, Inspired's gonna block it. Oh, are they gonna fight? Oh, what Holy, the wait, fuck that, was that? that? Jojo? I feel like that's the worst target for him to hit, though. Oh, oh Core's dead again. Oh. Core's dead again. Bye -bye. I think Core's actually dead here. Oh, wait, game time really check? Long. Game time? This game is a disaster. 34, 35. Anytime the game has too many enchanters, because like that's just been giving me aids lately, I'm just picking Nidalee with fucking First Strike and Treasure Hunter and just farming <laughs> gold, seeing how much gold I can get. Sure. Eight oh, kills. Wait, four? Wait, Kors, is he just dead? Oh, oh he he's flash. waiting hard. Oh, oh, that flash by Danny. That arrow, that arrow. How does he do it? Unlucky. GPOP. I think I think a lot of these small runes, by the way, are so undervalued. Like even going like bone plating overgrowth, um, I, I honestly think it could be a real thing on eighty carries. Like just having <laughs> bone plating for an all-in situation is crazy. So much value, you know. Yeah. It's like two hundred HP in an all-in. Overgrowth um, gives a fuck ton of health too. Yeah, overgrowth gives you like multiple hundred HP as an eighty carry and infinite scaling HP. Like. Yeah, you're not supposed to really like care about. The oh, Hans has flash. I think he might be okay here. Nice auto to, and he has cleanse. So what's gonna? He's baiting. Nice sidestep, dude. Oh, insane God. play. Oh. oh, oh no, not insane, not insane. Is Centaurin dead? Impact dead. Impact dead. One more Q. One more Q. Centaurin stab his ass. Oh, he didn't Run really go for it. He's a pussy. He's a pussy. <laughs> Yo, someone in chat point out. Impact's actually running face rush. Maybe he oh, was there listening. We go. He was listening in. Yeah, I was, I was like, why is it always Spellbook? I understand sometimes Spellbook, but like, Phase yeah. Rush is so good on Rise. Like, the champ just has great synergy with that rune because you get one combo off and then you can run around and get another combo off. It's just confusing. Oh, Project oh Ash, my OP God. arrow. Desperation arrow. Done. Let's Jojo go. Jojo reaction time. Jojo reaction time. Oh, oh we tried jumping jo into it. <laughs> and now we was dead. Oh. Holy shit. He. Fucking shimmied that Q, like it was Council of Blood. Ooh. Oh! Wow, these are just <laughs> such bangers. I feel like if Sneaky shot either of these, they both would have hit. Mm -hmm, yeah. Mm -hmm. Just arrow anyone. That used uh, to yeah. be the, the thing that triggered Sneaky is when we oh, like yeah. when no, we call hate, out for him to arrow. I hate like, Yo, just just all. He's like, stop. I hate me. when people tell me to arrow. It's actually so bad. Like I swear, yeah, yeah, never it's actually horrible. I mean, You'll it's, it's the same like, with like way more. Gauge, right? Like if, yeah. if yeah. someone else is telling you when to go, that's fucking troll. Yeah. You, you need the right timing on like their doing. movement, fucking their yeah, shits down. You're, you're, you're getting a read for how they move, and then like your teammates, like, dude, just fucking arrow. He's right there, and I'm like, he's right there. Yeah, like he also has hands. No. No, just shoot him, dude. Just just arrow anyone. <laughs> That's the classic com. Is Core not just trying to die standing like that? I'm so oh, confused. Shit. He, he, oh, he's shit. trying to buffer his like his hook off of not, uh, Leona Ulti, I think. Oh, he what the fuck is could have died there if they wanted to kill him. By E flash? Yeah. Could have, could have. Depends on how fast he, he he plays or like how fast he reacts. And that looked like a really good situation to just force it, but I guess they didn't have a lot of info in their RTPs and GPL and stuff, so I could see them not wanting to. Oh, wait, shit. Santorin's playing first strike, Darwin. Did he do that last game, too? I don't know. I don't think so. I think he had Conquistador. He's actually two levels down, I know. Jesus. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Conquistador. Merchant yeah. Victor. Oh, what the hell? That's not a good ulti. Oh, that kind of is a good ulti. It's, yeah, a, like it's the Patrick. Range. Patrick getting pelted with snowballs, but he likes it. He likes those snowballs in his mouth. Oh, oh. that was a kill. That was a kill. He could have flashed on Hans and fucking took him out. What is this Another arrow? One. What the fuck? 
Aren't these like really hard angles to actually hit if you arrow like that? Yes. Yeah. Oh my god. What the, the fucking canceling tempo. recalls? It's actually so good to do this. Let's go, Vulcan. Oh, <laughs> the fuck you, ulti as well. Oh. oh. Yo, let's fucking go. That's actually so fucked for them. I mean, not really though. He would yeah, lose his wave no matter what. Tower. Well, yeah, but the, the 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 cancel and the ulti didn't change that. They were gonna lose that tower anyways. All that yeah, did was they just have waste two ultis. Giga tempo. Yeah. Tempo Giga out tempo. the balls. Oh, oh Jojo! Oh, jo oh, oh God! Whippo! Dude. Would impact have done that? No. Oh no. man, Jojo is too young for this matchup. What can Whippo do? <laughs> I think <laughs> I think EG young opponent. I think EG has found their win con, and I would say a lot of teams might have just found their win con against TL. TL's early game is not good. Every game that they that they look shaky, it's because they get abused on their weakest point early game. Like, I think I, I'm like not really that convinced that TL is that good. I think they're. I think if they had a different AD carry player on their team, they could be really good. <clears throat> oh, like. Like someone with like a lot of experience sneaky? or something. Maybe like a guy who lifts a lot or something. I don't know. Like yeah, or like a guy who's very stealthy. Maybe like a weak weak side king. Like a two two time champion. It's funny because this is obviously NA's like biggest weakness. Like I would know because this happens to me all the time. Like what is North America's biggest weakness internationally? Is like. Our early oh, game no, is Santorin! Usually... What? Uh... He's like, please, guys, <laughs> oh. can I just get a fucking camp? Oh, wait, oh, it's actually oh, going well. It's a turn! It's a turn! Oh, what's happening? Who's winning? What is going no, on? Fine. I don't Can know. This is fucking... Oh. I think TL is winning, but they might get cleaned here. Oh. No, 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 This could be the Danny show. It's actually the Danny show. Impact! Oh, Danny Impact! E-Flash! Pierce, it's this fucking... Oh, Yeah, that's a quadra, right? Yo, let's fucking go. It's a quadra. Ooh, there it is. Yeah, but I, I definitely agree with what you're saying. I think more teams just need to get two free kills level one against TL. Because they, they don't look run, good in games where that why happens. Why are they not running the fucking gold rune? Those dumb fucks are... <laughs> they could be rich. Yo, I'm not going to lie. Watch Bjergsen pussy this out. I'm I'm, I'm a little I'm bit... I'm cringing a little bit. I'm cringing a little bit. So at the beginning, good. Good stuff. Good stuff. But the end, the end. He drops the R inspired. here. Oh my god. So many flashes over. Just so alpha. The fucking alpha male energy is off the charts. Did Bjergsen pussy out? Yeah, watch this, watch this. Where's the auto, buddy? Uh oh. This uh -oh. ease up, too. Yeah. Yeah, I think, yeah, yeah, I think he thinks he can get out, but he can't. Yeah, he should have just come uh, out. It was close to getting out. I don't blame yeah. him going for that, but. That's true, that's he true. Is he is kind of a close. pussy. I go for the kill there. Oh, definitely. the time. Danny is fucking online, dude. Look at the seven, eight k gold. He. I mean, is... no shit. They're all online. This is a fucking. <laughs> this is a slaughter. Actually, online they're... game. That's a stupid tweet. Actually, they're offline. True. True. <laughs> uh, no, I don't think their computers would be talking to each other if they were offline. Thank you. <clears throat> nice try. They actually don't have internet on those things. Actually, they do. That's how their computers are talking to each other. Mm, no, it's on a land network. Land network. Oh, objective bounty. Where that's what we're playing for, huh? Interesting, interesting. Woo! EG has these like solo queue comps, and I'm I'm vibing with it. I'm vibing with it. This they look like dog this shit, could be, but they they, they yeah they do. Winning. But it's like their players are just so comfortable. They're and very they good at playing a game with two kills level one and not doing no <laughs> flashes. That is true. Dude, I they are lose, super I don't, good in those situations. I don't think you lose the game off trading one for two level one. Wait, no, they I mean, lose the game 100% of the time, that the level flashes, 1. Yeah. That's pretty fucking cursed level 1. Oh! Ooh, the juke. Maybe he picked Ezreal because he knew Ash was coming. It could have been an actual bait. It's they not really a counter, though. Shit to I, I, I don't think a Ezreal is good against Ash. Like, yeah, if I think Ash goes is actually normally, You get it in the ass. You get it in the Ash? Yeah, but you yeah. dodge the arrows. Rude, it's big coggers. So, TL playing for the fucking... Objective bounty win con. <laughs> they play TL's playing really fast tempo, but the thing about EG that's really good is because they have like triple AD carries and rise, they farm so fast that they're they are also like matching really shortly after. So it's like TL has that first move here, 
But if it was like any other team comp that doesn't just instantly blow up the wave, oh. well, TL's gonna just die here. They're oh just my dead. god. Uh, I don't know, these rides might be fucked. Uh oh. Oh, he has they flaps, they're all dead. They're all dead. Well, yep, you're right. You're bye -bye. right, they are all dead. Holy oh. fuck! Jesus. Wait, Jojo almost died there. I'm surprised if they didn't Perfect. go on impact more. Maybe they couldn't. Legit tank grave spilled. Mm -hmm. I think it's Maybe he does game. it for the perma uptime on smoke bomb you're talking about. Oh, ho. no. It's actually no. like. It's definitely good. Not that bad. Good. <laughs> that ability is super broken. Especially if you follow up a CC with it. Like if they're rooted and you fucking smoke yes, bomb them. Yes, it's almost it's just like an a actual hard stun. stun. You just turn yeah. off their monitor for a sec. They're yep. actually trying Baron and Santorin just smited. But he's got another one coming. Impact! This is a knows. really fucking crazy cheese of him. I don't think he knows. There's no Wait, they're, way they're, they're, they're they actually see a hawk shot coming from Baron. They're actually not gonna check. Wait, it's they're dead. getting off. Wait. No, they're getting off. They literally could have gotten it. Wow. Why did they get off? I mean, that was wow. pretty fucking sus. I don't blame them for not getting off, but... I think what's crazy is this whole time, EG still doesn't know about the Baron attempt. Yeah, so they if they didn't knew, know. <laughs> if they knew, that that was their time to get Baron, actually. Because obviously you're not going to tank Baron for that long without being 1 HP, so they can assume that the enemy team reset. Wow, I, it was a good idea by TL, and then I think they just got cold feet thinking that the enemy team saw them somehow. They, they definitely got cold feet. I mean, I, I don't blame TL for getting off, to be honest, because I think it's a pretty fucking huge mistake for EG to not have any idea that, that could be happening. I mean, that's uh, the thing about the sneaks, though, isn't it? So what's, so yeah, what's the but like, you were right TL there. wins this game? I think... I think uh, I think at that point you just commit and you say if three of us die, but we get Baron, it's fucking worth. Because if I was to like like ballpark their fucking chance of winning the game, seven k gold down, the enemy team about to be on soul points, ten percent. But the chance of getting that Baron, of that being a positive play, is much greater than ten percent. So I, I know this is like because we have fucking observer view, but like, I think you just send it when it's that low, and you're willing to get, you're willing to like. Have your jungler just fucking smite oh. off that shit. Ooh. No splash. Right, He's no dead. Flash. Yeah. Is it a shutdown or not? That's what matters. It is. Yep. Six hundred dollars. Oh. Uh oh. whippo has oh. gone. Uh oh. Go down mid, EG. Run it down mid. Damn. That is not who you want the shutdown to be going to if you're EG. I think still though, there's still seven k gold up and soul point in four and a half minutes. If I'm EG here, I'm just thinking they have no chance of winning unless we do something really stupid. And they didn't and they're, they're, they're doing something this. really stupid. They didn't sleep the pit. Hmm. You're kidding me. You're kidding Danny me. Danny has a pink. He's just not you're, using you're it. You're fucking kidding me, man. This is this is not real. They, they just it's just dead, though. Committing to oh, it, yeah. Okay, okay, fuck it. It's real. It's real. Santorin totally could have just went for the 50-50 on it, but but like he would have died obviously instantly. Would have had a hard time getting in. He's low as fuck, no flash. Okay, uh, now EG's fucking impossible to throw, since they ended up getting that burger flip. Or if Impact has flash, has flash. wants to die, has flash. Oh. Oh, Jojo's getting caught. Wait, Centaur might die here. It's Impact, by the way. Oh, no mind. No, it's Jojo. It's playing Rise mid lane. Wait, Jojo? Oh. Jojo! Oh! Oh! They are getting all dead. fucking... All dead. All dead. They're all dead. They're all Edward dead. Cullen right there. That was... Yeah, they're all dead. Bad Lucian ult. <laughs> Danny is fucking his own cock. Oh, my God. Yeah. Just walking in Victor ult. <laughs> <laughs> that was a nasty Lucian ult. Yeah, it was. Inspired, go and kill him. Inspired, go and kill him. Oh, nice ulti backwards. <laughs> yeah, that, how much damage did that do to them? <laughs> I think oh, it almost hit the rip. minion wave. Wait, wait, it was good. <laughs> yeah, I know. I'm just memeing. He shot it backwards. I've never seen a Graves do that, actually. Ulti backwards really? to get an auto range. I mean, I, I, I haven't seen it for a while. Not never, but... 
No. It's been a while since I've seen that. Yeah, I mean, there's not a whole lot of situations you'd want to use it that yeah, way. It's pretty but... rare. It's pretty rare. <laughs> if you start watching him, you can kind of sidestep it from that range almost every time. Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah. Eclipse Ezreal? Guess it doesn't matter. I've seen it. Big damage. Not a Holy lot of shit. Core JJ with the super flank. Super dragon steel. Let's go. Oh! What? Wait, what's happening? I don't know. What's They're happening? Engaging with support jungle? Wait, whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa. What's happening? Whoa! You're winning Lucy. this! Whoa, whoa, whoa. what's Wait. happening? Whoa! Danny? Wait. They're actually Danny's hard gonna winning that. Wait, Danny's what? Gonna kill fuck? What just they happened? They just double TP'd in. Oh, dude, it was literally the Zonia Jarvan. But I don't have time for the TPs. That's fucking awesome. What the fuck? Hold up. Sonia's? Oh, and Danny's killing them all. Can Danny's they actually oh, kill Danny? Is he though? Is he though? They can't, they can't kill him. They can't, they can't kill him. They can't kill him. They can't kill him. Danny is absolutely running laps around TL right now. Yeah. Ocean yeah, he's sold. fucking him pretty hard. Dude, yeah, Danny can just walk up and auto him to death. Where the fuck are you, Bjergsen? Show yourself. Oh! oh. Get oh my god! I feel like before Bjergsen left to become a coach, he could have outplayed that. <laughs> Jesus. Can't draft your way out of this one, bitch. There's not a lot of hope for TL here. They're about to get triple in-hit minions, like, uh, where there's six supers all at once on the next round. So this one, EG, EG could probably get something on this one too, but, like, on the next one, it's... it's e oh, oh my Jeez. god. Oh my god. Oh, I didn't even that's see him just, get deleted. That's he just disgusting. got fucking shot. Yeah. In the oh, wait, they're hole. kind of killing JoJo, but he has J. No, this Damn, nothing dude. To do. JoJo actually popped the fuck off this game on Lucian. Yeah, he smurfed. Danny's kind of smurfing too, but... I mean, yeah, they both. But just watching they're... the fights, I feel like JoJo's playing the fights really well. He keeps getting out at low HP. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 He's creating a lot of space. Holy shit! We got ourselves a series. Again. What I've noticed about TL that, that's starting to come up now is like they're really good at playing a ball comp versus a ball comp. But they're they don't have the same level of like cleanliness when they play against a weird ass solo queue comp. Like getting pressured early game. They're just not used to it. They're used to winning their lanes. And yeah, it's, I think it's just about a comfort level for them. This shit is like, the enemy team threw your curveball, so how are you going to deal with it? Lucian top versus GP. Weird level one. Getting invaded on by Inspired. I don't know. Kind of just... Kind of just don't want... They, they won two games with R. They, they lost two games with Victor. I think... Kind of want C. Bjergsen on early game pick instead of hard scaling now. Perfect. The games are going to shit early, and Victor is not helping. Even though the champ is giga broken. Oh my god, Vigor! Oh my god! Wait, they actually picked Nid? Yikes. Renekton Nidalee. Oh. Uh. Scion Instalock. <laughs> Hmm. Whippo's defeated after that. After the, um, you gonna dive me, game. bitch? Yeah, fuck, like, oh, you guys. fuck this, man. Just give me some weak side shit. <laughs> Joe, 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 Joe. Can he hard carry? Can he knock Bjergsen out of playoffs? Upper bracket. Upper bracket. Specifically. <laughs> and I'm buffering. What are you buffing? Oh my god. Level is this a real dive? Again. I don't think so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It is, it is. But Sintorn dead. Dorn's dead. No, not worth the... Wait, Vulcan got to kill. Hold on. Is he going to carry? That's actually, that's, actually, hmm. that's actually turbo worth for... 
Jinx specifically because she gets the kill and then the, the the next wave and then she just bases like this. It's like worth for Jinx thinking worth for Jinx. Well, she didn't lose <laughs> me, think so. I fucking Jinx. hope so. Yep, shut up, shut up, video. Since AD queued for the carry, that means it's good for the team. Ah, I don't want to hear. I it. see. No, not the Krabby Patty. Oh, wait, what is Inspired doing? Wait. Oh wow, Santorin is so smart. So smart. Yeah, he's so smart. Walking the fuck away from his buff. No, like I, I think the fact that he pulled it there to to eyeball that choke, so he didn't get surprised when Vulcan walked up. Like I don't think a lot of junglers would do that. And then he and then he unleashed the fucking blue when he saw that they were coming. Mm. Like it was. Yeah, it was I mean, it, very aware. I don't think it's like play. the craziest thing ever, but it, it is good to do. Yeah. I mean, I, I think, think a lot of people in that situation is... would do that though, because Nidalee, oh, okay. like, she lives for this shit, like, to just invade you if she ever gets ahead. Yeah. And yeah. then, like, she would have saw he didn't have his blue when he did the bot dive. Why oh, the wow. hell is and the mid laner is... top? This is not oh, worth even if they kill him. Can they Straight kill up, him? Not... Even if they kill him. Even if they kill him. Which is this not worth for to. Jinx? Wait, they this actually have a redive here. Yeah, they. It, it I, I love He's dead. slow dives like this. It, it, like, wow. I don't. I don't think this is worth it at all. Not even. Not even a little bit. Like, Dude, you know, he you TP'd killed... up here, like just as a slow fucking yeah. dive like that. Yeah. He. I mean, what does Scion miss here? He dies. Renekin gets a kill. What did he miss? One melee minion. Cool. You lost more than that mid by far. So unless this kill on on Renekin is gonna be like fucking game changing, I think it's troll. Hmm. I think Scion specifically, you just don't want to send resources there and like miss stuff on other in other areas if it, if like it doesn't completely screw him over. Uh huh. Yeah. I, wait, he's just going bot and doing the same shit. What am I watching? What the fuck? Surely he needs to lane mid at some point. Dude, this is Dude, some high is, shit. Is is TL actually is is TL gonna call or like play accordingly here? Because this is. This is like potentially a fucking nasty play. How is he not trolling? <laughs> I, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> this is so funny, actually. What the fuck? I, I don't know. Wait. Oh? Okay. He's just walking around and says, fuck minions. I don't give a fuck. Yeah, I think that was a little bit too much. That was pretty troll. Really, how badly did he get fucked here? I, I do want to see. He's five and a half, and I want them to look at Bjergsen's XP and see, is he six and a half? Is he down like a full level? Is he only down half a level? He got impact um, pretty head, right? Yeah. Maybe his it's bot like, lane he got needed impact, some help. He kind of got an impact to kill a head, but like, he never he didn't put Bwipo behind anything. Like, it's he, Bwipo is exactly the same, like dead on with impact on XP. So, I don't just, he got his jungler so ahead. Have his eye on here. He helped his bot lane push in the wave. Yeah, that's true. For a reset, got impact ahead. Although gold is equal. <laughs> Someone in my chat says Birger shit just stays in lane. <laughs> 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 yeah, because he's, it would be trolling if he went anywhere Why? else. <laughs> Why is Birger shit always just staying in lane? <laughs> Birger shit, dude. <laughs> what is he doing? This fucking idiot is just punishing the Rome. In a game five, he's just jerking off mid. Look how ahead Nidalee is, though. So passive. Unbelievable stuff. Ooh. Hold up. Hold up. Oh. Keck, wait, Keck, wait. 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 Joe, Joe, Joe. Joe's actually start. totally fine. Adventure. Yeah, he's oh too fucking God. tanky oh! with his spellbook. Uh oh. This looks a little forced. Oh. Oh my god, oh. he, he fucking Burger swagged him. The <laughs> oh my god, he <laughs> finally left mid on accident. <laughs> Dude, how did he do that? Dude, check his PC, check his PC. Does he have hacks or some shit? I yo, thought he, he, cool. yo, he went negative gold. He fucking broke the game. <laughs> he left his lane he and he lost does. fucking money. We the found punishment. out why he never leaves mid. He has negative 84 gold from fucking futures market, dude. He's on Wall Street <laughs> bets right now. He's actually cheating. No, no, he's it's because he mid. He's not supposed to do that. <laughs> this behavior is not normal. 
why did they get randomly so horny here with no oh, fucking way of killing them? This is just flashing, <laughs> resulting into a 2v3. It, it was really close. So if Santorin dies before he can get the reset on Vulcan, it's pretty close. I mean, how is he dying there, though? He has flash. Like, they don't actually have damage to kill him. I mean, it was it was close. No, it wasn't. <laughs> Man. By the it's way, if Rise Jojo... Leona, they have such limited damage and no possible wolves... extra damage. Yeah, that's true. There's no fucking chance he dies there. I'm just fucking spitballing because I've never seen it. Usually people just straight max E because the cage CD is so important. Yeah, yeah. He, he should be putting the rest past this one point. Yeah. Uh-oh. going on here? I don't know, but it's... I, I think... Wait. Oh, is taking a lot of damage. Oh, he's it's, dead. It's bigger shit, dude. Ooh. Oh, run, run, run. Oh, yeah. Wait. There's no way he dies. Oh, he had a flash. The spear was too good. Ooh, yeah. How the fuck is he doing it? Leaving lane again? Dude. What a mad lead. They, they should investigate, see if someone else is on his PC. <laughs> yeah, I'm kind of suspicious now. Oh, wow. Danny doing a pretty solid adaptation, I would say. He's just going crack and Slayer because he's playing against Sion TK. Yeah, there, there are some tanky boys. You almost never see that with the Felios. And he's maxing attack speed second. You can see on the bottom left there. So he's going for like just like auto attack spamming of Felios. Now the, the problem that you end up oh wait where's no flash he's is he he's okay though he's okay oh no the Aphelios all goes wide oh this <laughs> what big the fucking wait fuck this looks so uh, fucking awkward wait oh, oh the traps the traps are so good the traps are so good God. oh they're gonna chase down and die this no, is they turn. would lose without Whipple being here oh this is my full desperation God, God. Oh, my God oh no any banani. Yeah, that's going to do it for this one. That's a wrap. That's actually game. Wow. That felt, that did feel so desperate. I mean, yeah, they, I mean, they're just over forcing literally everything. Cause they just, just like, fuck, we need this kill. We have an early game comp. We can't afford to not win early game. Yeah. And that's how you really do it. Like an early game comp doesn't just completely fall off a cliff after 15 minutes you can take your time like making the game so easy for them in the beginning i was I, my initial reaction was oh core fucked up and then i saw his whole team was there so right here everyone turned around bjergsen turned around hans turned around so it was just a 4v4 and oh my god so many I mean, abilities just whiffed yeah there. EG kind really of troll. like whiffed everything i yeah, feel like this is actually an okay fight in the beginning the time, on the Tom. traps here the traps to cut everyone off exactly when Vulcan presses E is so good. Vulcan went so fucking deep, man. Yeah. Oh my god. Actually yeah, gets everybody killed. I feel like with this glacial thing on supports, they should just be legit first iteming Zonia. Because they're so fucking squishy. Like, they just actually go in and die instantly. He's chilling. Uh, look at JoJo's level, by the way. He is uh, lower than his fucking jungler and AD carry yeah he uh he certainly didn't put a high priority on getting experience this game to back dead oh shit holy moly <laughs> wait e. oh wow what did, did he, he die sunfire or the fucking what was cannon that? i'm what? so confused what killed him what the hell the spectator flash bug definitely made that look so scuffed yeah yeah it was the cannon minion right it was the cannon minion auto that like glitched fucking through the matrix because you can't see the animation for it yeah i, I guess if we're saying this sunfire burn i mean is that oh he whipped that spear wait what and he put the traps he actually wrong. won't kill uh huh. <laughs> all oh. right yeah unlucky 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 so one one thing to think about that i know is a bit of a cope is like the xp that jojo lost wait oh, what vulcan really just gonna die like that recalling yeah. oh my yeah. god wait he's fine wait wait oh wait 
Wait, can Wait. Core slurp him there? QR? Ooh. Oh, good. He sure did. He slurped no, him No, no, no. Like, can't you range eight people if they have the stacks? If you stun them with the Q. Look, he did. Wait, Maybe I thought the it stacks was... Right I'm actually a slightly confused about the eating thing. I thought it was just he, if he hits W, auto Q. Does W give a stack? I don't think so. This is so cursed. I think... This game just feels horrible because EG's EG has Oh? Oh shit. They don't have that kind of like clever win condition that they used to have in the other games. Oh, oh Bjergsen gets his ass pound. Uh oh, oh impact shit. on oh, a shit. huge play. Wait. Wait. They're actually throwing. I'm kinda Good. happy to edit to Wait. see EG kinda coming back a bit. Uh, Rizal? Wait, Danny? Oh! Wait! Oh! Where's his fire? They need you, bro! Wow. Whippo? Dead. Okay. We got ourselves a game, boys. Winnable. I kind of don't want EG to die with a whimper because it's kind of not hype. True. Yeah. We got stopwatch on top and AD for... Oh, we got five stopwatches this fight. All fucking EG's top side has a stopwatch. And TL's AD carry on top have one, so... Let's see. Let's Yo, see what boom. happens. Bjergensen just got death cap. Yeah, he is actually really poor. 1k Compare his items. 1k? You think so? Two items? Mm, Maybe. Nah. Maybe like... I'm guessing like... 700. Oh. Yeah, I would say 700. Holy shit, Bipo just ran it down. No, Bipo or just ran it down, he. straight up. That's 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 not good. Or that's not did good. he? Oh! Or did he? Close. Does he have TP? If he yeah. has TP, he can do, he can run it down again. Woo! Stop him. Nidalee. Oh, 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 oh. Wait, don't go in oh, on that. Oh, the spear. Just poke. Yeah. Oh, Just he stopped Whippo. It's actually they big. Stop Whippo. I think TL, I think TL yo, can't fight. Yo, Inspired, go fucking spear him. Who's TPing? When he speared, yo, are they getting calling. Baron here? Oh, Inspired's going, and they're going to have their homies solo it. This is a throw by TL. They're Wait, not even, they get even doing drag. They're oh, legit God. not even doing dragon. This is, this is a throw by TL, I think. Yeah, this yeah, is a throw. Yeah, this one look good. Oh, they're they're wait, the cage, the cage. <laughs> no, 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 if they see five, oh, they don't need to finish. Never mind. Huh. My bad. Oh, Vulcan God. Gets cage. Oh, God. Ooh, God, this okay, is fucking yes, weird, friends. dude, with the range. Yeah, I mean, yeah. it's it, both comps like this don't really want to walk into the other team. So whoever has the position is going to have advantage for the fight. Are they actually not going to do drag, man? It's so awkward, I guess. Just do it now. Some, someone needs to do it. I don't know. They're so far behind that TL can just yeah. do it. Yeah, just fucking get the... Get I mean, the... Inspire needs to kill everyone and steal here. Oh. Oh, God. Oh, or God. he just doesn't uh, care no. enough. No! no. Bounty. <gasps> oh. oh. The bounty, the bounty. How much is he going to give? It goes from 40.6. 600 gold for drag. Like, that's so fucking good. Dude, if already... Jigsalt stole the fucking dragon and they got soul off that, that would have been the yeah. biggest kick in the balls to EG. Yeah. <laughs> look at the look at the Baron like uh gold swing so far. It starts at 1500. They traded with drag in like a couple waves. It's just back to even. Like that's so good for EG. I would honestly if I was TL, I would be kind of upset that we that they weren't able to get soul. It's Yeah, I mean they yeah. still have two and a half minutes on this Red Bull Baron buff power play. So they can definitely get more. That is true. Th that is game time check. Point, uh, 16, 16 17, 17, 18. Yeah. I was like a second and a half ahead, I guess, earlier. Maybe two. You bastard. <clears throat> mm hmm. Hey guys, why does uh, Bopo have a uh, Tiamat? Titanic. Yep, Titanic. Okay. It's it's OP. Like your last two items, you go Titanic and then Gwensu. Oh my you just god! Pop off. Impact super flank. Oh my wait. Renekton is the shittiest. He's actually flank getting in there. No He's gonna Renekton? Oh, no. Oh, 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 oh my god! Yo, wait, wait, they're actually doing the classic fucking all gangbang into bot lane and get oh, flank strat. No A personal way. favorite wait, of Medios. Who's winning? Who's winning? It's EG. Uh, it's EG. EG's winning. EG's winning. Egg. Nah, man. It's egg. Teams, 
Why is every team so fucking obsessed with oh! this play? It's so troll. Oh god, save his fire, save his fire. It's literally the worst way you can team Help! fight. Holy sh... <laughs> yeah. No matter fucked. where you go, you're walking into the enemy team. So troll. Oh, wow. Three man... Three man Leon ulti to start the fight. EG can actually win the game now. They... They completely shut down their team's Baron. 5k gold. And, oh my god, it's gonna be worse. They're gonna get another bounty here. They got all shutdowns bought and another bounty. That's crazy. That was such a fucking crazy flank. They watched Wait, was he just hiding? Like, not run. even TP? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah he, yeah, just he was. There. Lol, holy shit, dude. No. And he Secret fucking avoids agent. the minions and just sneaks up. I so sneak good. this. They had How such a nice engagement, dude, dude, Volcaneer. It is. Yeah, it was sick, and I think it's really smart of Impact that he was hugging the bot side so that Ward didn't see him. Yeah, they had no so idea many... until he was there. Yeah, god, there was so many, like, little things about that that made it a lot better than it should have been. And then, dude, the fucking double stopwatch from EG <laughs> to stop Wibbo from killing them. Terrified of Scion. <laughs> yeah. I don't know, they kind of need another, now. like, super nasty fight like that to actually get back in this game. I think they're still too behind. Yeah, they're yeah, still I mean, they behind. need TL to do some troll-ass play like that. But, but momentum is definitely on their side, like... They, yeah, they, I they... think TL just needs to group on mid-wave and control Dragon and it should be a pretty easy win for them. I don't know, shit's getting real sketchy. I mean, they, they were just trolling. Just a little bit of trolling. Oh. Ooh, Santorin with the little little 9.5 mechanics. Nine, nine out of 10, not 9.5. Nine and a half inch mechanics? Yeah. <laughs> this entire the last drag fight is banking on whether or not... I, I mean, like, whether or not they can kill Hans, but also, if Danny doesn't have IE, I really don't see him doing much damage. Like, he's so behind the curve. You usually uh, there, see... There, there's no fucking way EG wins a fight unless TL griefs it. I mean, yeah, that is probably true. If they give up the spot for whatever they're doing right now, I'm going to be tilted. For whatever they're Don't be doing there. <laughs> I don't, dude, I feel if I'm TL, I'm spitting on this vision. Oh, uh huh. Like, yeah, I don't know who you're talking about. <laughs> the point of taking vision control is so that at every bush, like every step of the way, you're getting a potential engage or a chunk or whatever on them while they check your vision. But they're just fully giving it. Yeah. That no, was, what was there. the point of getting the vision if you're just going to do that? There's not even a Baron yeah, to trade for. It, it, unless you this had a is... really good buy off of it, that was I mean, completely even still, worthless. there's like very few items that I feel like are actually worth giving up this positioning for. This is like... No, I agree. Makes your fight so fucked if you have to I, walk I, into them. I totally agree. Like, it's it's not good. And wow, <laughs> I don't so like where Inspire is standing. Whoa, 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 whoa. Wait, does he have Zonia? Okay. Someone's oh, gonna die! Wait. Someone's gonna die! Wait! He, oh, no. Uh, he's but chunked. That flash. Wait, they actually didn't get him. Ah, oh, man. Oh EG's positioning God. is actually Danny's trolled. Dead. Danny's so dead. Split. Danny's dead. Oh, shit. Why is Inspire it's... not with his fucking backline? Oh. It's so over. Confused. It's is over. Is literally a flank champion? GG. Wait, Ons? No. Oh, I'm... So, man, I, I really don't like the way Inspired played that. I don't see why the hell he was where he was. I didn't even he see him. He needed to help his backline I didn't even see kill him. people. I was just watching he was, Danny. He was like by the Raptor, like on the ramp with Renekton. You shoot and so then TL, spears. if they see that, they just run at the other three. You're not worried about Nidalee flanking you. Boom. He did clear the wave. Is that... Nah. They got it. Fucking Whippo backs off so he can just like ulti to do damage. Yep. I think TL wins this. Dude, what if the Nexus had like yeah, you're gonna say that. the backdoor armor? That'd be interesting. I, I think I would actually like that. I would prefer it did. Yeah, it it's very scary when you have open Nexus. You have no open protection Nexus ever feels again. so fucking doomed, man. It's like no matter yeah. what, yeah. you're gonna fucking lose the game. Yep. You have to get really creative with open nexus. Because the other team doesn't have to ever fight you. They just have to fucking fight your nexus. Yeah. Well, 
Let's we go, actually Gerson. got wow. a three-two series. Very unexpected. That was a good one. That was fun. That was fun. FBI was right when he said that Teal and EG are evenly matched. I don't know how that could ever happen, but I think TL's just TL's just worse than we expected, probably. I mean, TL's worse than everyone expected. I don't think that EG it played better than expected. I just thought that TL would be a lot better, but like now, I'm not even that confident in TL winning the split. Like, it seems like 100 Thieves is right up there. Uh -oh. Yeah, maybe, from maybe these better. games. I definitely think, yeah, each or hundred thieves has looked the most solid of all the teams that I've played. Yep. Yeah. Close release in Poggy. I don't know, like, if you were trying to say like what TL was doing wrong this series, like, what would you even point to? It feels like a lot of the games they were losing or getting behind, they were just kind of like doing some weird ints. Well, it, it was the, the core in that one game, and then the level one completely yeah, fucked yeah, exactly. them in game it's, four. It's like core troll picked Alistair, and then they like hard lost the level one. It never really felt like TL was just playing horrible. They did just give that position you were talking about, but ended up not mattering. Yeah. I don't think EG played correctly with it. I think it would have been a hard fight either way, but still, like, TL is trying to give them an advantage. Yeah. Hold up. I, I'm going to be right back. And, uh, yeah, just thank you guys all for, for showing up. It was amazing. Thank you to the fans. Yay! Thank you to for Yay. the interview. What a series that we witnessed today. Oh, my goodness. There is more for us to cover. Would have loved to hear his thoughts on Fasting Rise in Game 5, Vigil, but... <laughs> Maybe another time. <laughs> soon enough, but for now... That'd be over. such a Stay good question. Down. It would. Yo, uh, how did it feel when JoJo just didn't show up in your lane for three minutes in a row? <laughs> what did you think he was doing? <laughs> did you wonder if you needed to pause? Yeah. <laughs> oh, I think JoJo might have seen guys. Where'd my mid laner go? Ramadan rise. <laughs> Jesus Christ, man. Ramadan rise, what the fuck? <laughs> can only farm at the start and the finish of the game. Can't farm anything mid-game. <laughs> genius strats, genius strats. Holy That's fuck. That's the stupidest shit I've ever heard. <laughs> that is a All good right. skin. Uh, GG's, boys. G I'll see oh, you guys GGs. tomorrow for the, the next game. Oh, yeah, yeah. Love yeah. it.